going. I'm just currently in the background here trying to set up the YouTube stream. So right. take it away. I'll leave, you, I'll leave you to it. So what we're going to do tonight, we're going to play a race to nine, and it's best of three sets. We're playing 10 ball. And as I said, Jim is playing on a nine foot and Nate is playing on a little boy's table on a seven foot <laughs> table. And, and this is how we're starting, huh? This is how and, we're his starting. and his pockets are bigger than mine. This is how we're starting. <laughs> so, uh, gents, who wants to go first? Do you want to flip a coin? Do you want to lag? What do you want to do? Oh, uh, we got to talk, talk about what we're given. We got to talk about a couple of things first. Let me, let me take over for just a second. So. Okay, go on in. For everybody who's been around the podcast for a while, you know that we are trying to really work on building a community here. And part of that, uh, the first step of that is going to be a Moscone Cup traveling journey this community. coming year. Uh, and part we were, of that, it was supposed to be in Vegas, uh, but we are, of course, of going changing that to the UK. Moscone well, I should say Matrim is changing that to the UK. Traveling so we are going to change with it. Year. Uh, we are going to uh, still put to together well, a package, well, package for people to go to the Moscone Cup. So and I believe Nada Hoffman is uh, uh, heading this up as far as actually getting a hotel and flights. And my job is going to be to work on the tickets. Now, I am setting aside 40 tickets to the Moscone Cup that we are going to be working and, on getting. Uh, my job and this to work on the tickets. little now, exhibition match that Jim and I are doing right now, tickets, uh, we are giving away a $1,300 Jacoby Custom Cube, and the same this, one from the qualifiers. Little uh, exhibition yes, match it was won by somebody. Right and if you uh, we are giving thought about it for eight seconds, you'll probably see as to why we are wrapping it up again. But we are going to be giving that cue away today to only the people who donate about today. Well, I should say up until this point, and then until we actually do the drawing but we are going so you're going to gonna be able to win yourself a thirteen hundred dollars to go be custom cue which has uh, really well, never been done on our streams before there's a huge so we chance we actually have a, of so winning a really great cue there's not going to be that many entries uh and we're also giving away a poison uh break you a two hundred dollar poison break you to whoever donates the most amount of money now when we're talking about the money and what we are doing is it is all going toward buying those forty tickets i'm not pocketing this jim's not pocketing this this is going to be to the people who are going to the Moscone Cup to start paying for those tickets. So theoretically, if we raised $4,000 and 40 people were going and the tickets were 100 bucks a piece, we just paid for the tickets. Theoretically speaking. Uh, and then, of course, prorated. Now, if you're going to the Moscone Cup, I'm not talking about the gym's not pocket on that. This is going to be for the people who are going to the Moscone Cup. You must start paying for those tickets. So theoretically, to be able to take advantage of four thousand. So the people who do not know where they were today, the two would be fun, whether it's $5 to pay for the tickets, theoretically, you cannot partake in the And then, of course, this little thing that we're doing. So, theoretically, well, I guess, yeah. If you want to go to the Moscone Cup, Moscone Cup, and you want to be in our group with us, you can do so. All you have to do is let me know. And if you would like to have part of your tickets paid for, potentially all of your tickets you want to pay for, you need to donate a minimum of five dollars to the stream today and then you can theoretically get a hundred dollars worth of benefit for a five dollar donation so i wanted to get that out of the way early on to donate before we minimum started and that's what you can win is a thirteen hundred dollars to go of you and a poison break if you want to donate a little bit more but that's where we're uh that's that's what we're doing with the money that we raised today is we're going to be buying tickets to the moscone and a poison break and when and when they said that that's where we're myself and nate will not be benefiting from this in any way that's actually not in entirely true because well, uh, I, I fully expect that, that, that each, of, uh, each of these 40 people buy me a beer at the Moscone Cup. Anyway. <laughs> so I expect to be drinking free because I expect to be drinking free for at least one evening so while I'm there. Each of these 40 people buy me a beer at the Moscone Cup. You're all free to come buy me a beer. I always, you know, there's no beer better than free beer. So buy him a nice cider. Just a, that's just a, just a, that's a, a wake's drinks for night, I think, Jim. Mark is in prime form today with a cider. And uh, theoretically speaking, um, if you give a dollar for every time that Nate said theoretically in his little speech there, that's ten dollars right there. So we're well underway, right? If you give a dollar, if I'd have known that, I would have said Theoretically, if I'd have known that before, I would have said dollars right there. And we are going to be playing this. Well, there we go. Purely as fun. Donate. We both want to win it. We're both going to be trying our best to win it. I know there's a couple of people that have put money on this match. We are trying our best to win it, but we also 
now we'll be trying our best to sharpen each other. So we're going to have a bit of fun with it. We're going to be we're, we're going to be uh, talking all the way through it to each other, trying to sharpen each other. Uh, but we are both trying to win. Um, I don't think I've got much chance. I'm playing against an 843 Farmville race on a seven foot on a seven foot table with pockets that are bigger than my pockets. I've got much chance. I've got a busted up shoulder. I've got a new cloth, new rail. No chance to it. Hey, listen. Look, right there, buddy. All right. I got the vaccine. I'm dizzy. I have COVID symptoms. You sound like oh. Lewis Hamilton there, Jim. You, you, hey, listen. you got enough Look, excuses right there, there, Jim, for Lewis right. Hamilton for an entire season. Nate went for his vaccine today, and they stuck like like the needle in there, Jim. And gravy hey, listen, came out. enough excuses there, Jim, for Lewis Hamilton for an entire season. Nate went for his vaccine today, and they stuck the needle in there, Jim. And gravy I mean, Nate, I'm not used to seeing the bottom half of your body. Normally, you're sitting behind your desk. I didn't realize you had such a big ass. It's crazy. I mean, Nate, I'm not when you, I'm not used when you to walk backwards, do things start beeping? Oh, Jesus. Jim, I don't think that is actually a seven foot table. I think his ass is just so big, it's actually a nine foot table. It's just making it no. look small. You guys' words. I don't think that is actually a seven foot table. When Nate, when Nate was at school, he sat beside everybody. Foot table. It's just when, it no. small. when Jim talks, it's very rude. Yeah, the best I can come up. All right, shut up. Let's get this thing going. Are we going to flip a coin? Let's get this thing going. When, uh, yeah, so let's go. When Jim I talks, think, uh, it's very rude. Yeah, uh, the best I can come up. All right, shut up. Let's get this thing going. Let's get this thing going. When, uh, yeah, so let's get this thing going. When Jim talks, it's very rude. Yeah, let's get this thing going. 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 Let's get this I was going to say, Nate, Flip a coin. This is your show. Uh, it's heads. It's heads. Uh, I will boom. Heads. I'm going first. Well, right. so actually, Billy Good luck, Cat Daddy. Good luck, bagpipes. <laughs> uh, Certainly we'll plenty go of wind going, going around. Right. right. Good luck, Cat Daddy. Don't believe in any gaps in Good those luck, balls, eh? Bagpipes. <laughs> and remember, you've got to break Certainly from behind the line. Wind going, going around. No, no, no. We Good agreed to Jeffrey Dolan. Don't believe in any gaps in those balls, Yeah? All right. <laughs> and remember, you've got to break from behind the light. Okay, so I just saw that my audio was a little... No, low. no, we How agreed to Jeffrey Dolan. Yeah? Alright. Coffee tables are always low, Chris, you should know that. Hey, hey. Hey. Oh, yeah, and Nate, and Nate, also, Nate also took away my soft break. I'm not allowed to soft Coffee break. Coffee tables either. are always low, Chris, I'm, you know that. I'm giving away everything here. Hey. Is that still in the kitchen? Slightly forward of the line there. Yeah, yeah, can I get a rules? Can I get a rules clarification? Harvey, are you still, are you still not even broke yet? You're worse than Maluka. Is that still in the kitchen? Can I get a rules? That's rude. Can I get a rules clarification? It's very rude thing you just said, Jim. This is, you know, Jim, this is going to be very difficult, I think. Yeah, yeah, can I get a rules? That's rude. Okay. It'd be a terrible way to start. It's very rude thing you just said, Jim. Oh, what a break. You know, Jim, this what is going to be very difficult. No, no, difficult. Where's the cue ball? Where's the cue ball? Oh, did he start? Yeah, it's, it's, it's in his hand. He just, oh, he just his hand. moved the, he just moved the four ball down break. the rail. No, he just the four ball's the off the ball. table, you clown. You just moved one of the balls in your hand. Oh, Are you dumb or stupid? God, you're... Oh, you're already starting. It's going to be so difficult, Jim. Chris, Chris, do you get the idea that we're not going to be needed to? I'm just waiting for the car. Chris, it's definitely going to be needed. They're going to need a referee. I'm just waiting for the car. I'm definitely going to be needed. Normal people would call that a long shot, but in a medium shot, yeah. I'm just waiting for the car. I think you get really good out of this. No problem. That's an 863 Fargo, people. 863 Fargo, you're watching here. Look, a little bit of a problem here, though, Jim, to get to the six ball. He's a little bit slim just to draw back, I suppose, to leave the six in his side. He's got six ball. He's going to fail it. A little bit of a problem here, though, Jim, to get to the six ball. Oh, friendly little nudge there on the eight ball. I don't think he plays that. He's a lucky little brush. Shut your whore mouth. A friendly little tickle. Oh, friendly little nudge there on the eight ball. I don't think he plays that. He's a lucky little brush. Shut your whore mouth. Careful you don't fall in one of those pockets, Nick. Friendly little tickle. His ass will stop him. No, I was going to say, even that, even an ass that size won't stop and falling through one of them. I'm not in those pockets. <laughs> This is what we're doing in life, huh? No, this is how we're this is how we're doing this. I'm not gonna close America, I'm gonna bum your cat. 
I've never seen this is what we're doing in life. Hey, so this is how we're, keep, how we're doing keep the cat comments out of this. <laughs> That's rude. <laughs> so first Nothing wrong with my little kitty. Uh, uh, Rome Harper, so thank you so much for the uh, 150 keep, stars. Keep the cat and I just heard another one from <laughs> <laughs> Ian Stitchin. I hope I said that correctly. Thank you so much. He's a he's a cute tech guy. Keep the cat comments out of this. Another one from Ian Stitchin. I hope I said that correctly. Thank you so much. Oh, we're gonna have to penalize him. Iraq, his stream's not working. <clears throat> you, you're fucking with me, aren't you? <laughs> oh, that's dirty, Jim. Oh, that's, that's really dirty. You're fucking with me, aren't you? That's a really dirty thing you just did, Jim. Oh, that's very. Oh, that's dirty. I will tell you if, this, if there's something that's wrong with really this. That's a, oh man, that's a that's very a really dirty, dirty thing you just did. That completely got me. This shot's already hard enough. I will tell you if there's something wrong with this. 16th of an inch off the rail. Oh, man, that's But it's hanging over the corner pocket. That completely It doesn't go in shot. Oh, you it's hanging over the corner pocket. Shut your mouth. 16th of an inch off the rail. Oh, man, that's hanging over the corner pocket. That completely It doesn't go in shot. Oh, you it's hanging over the corner pocket. Oh, no. Shut your mouth. Just a bit outside. I live closer than that. That shot was so difficult. You guys are rude. Shut your mouth. So yeah, dirty. I was gonna have a good clean match up here. I live. You did well though. You got seven goals on me. That shot was so difficult. Wow. Six were on the break. That's a zero. I have a good clean match up. Oh, thanks. So for those that are wondering, uh, this is a race to two wow. sets. Uh, Six were on the break. It's going to be a race to five. We're not counting uh, balls ran, which are those that are rack ran. Uh, this is a race. Hey Jim, watch out for those side pockets. They kind of creep up on you. It could be a long night. Oh, it's a well, no, it's a nine. Sorry, isn't it? I thought we was playing so nine ball for a minute. I thought we got a golden break. Blackout, baby. Oh, nine, sorry, isn't it? I thought we playing nine ball for a minute. I'm doing my I'm doing my solo for Jacoby. This thing is sick. <laughs> yeah, so, that was some break, wasn't it? <laughs> Two balls off it. Nine in the side. I thought we were playing nine ball for a second. That was some break, wasn't it? I've done the easy bit. Now I'm going to get out of here. Two balls off it. Yeah. Nine try and uh, try and do it sometime this week, buddy. <laughs> it took you half an hour to break. <laughs> wow, I was nervous. I had to get control yeah. of my nerves. Try and uh, try and do it sometime this week, buddy. Yeah. I think I'd be more worried about getting control of that light bulb, pal. <laughs> well, I was nervous. I had to get control yeah, of my nerves. So try, and, uh, try and do it sometime. Oh, oh, oh he's a big shot, man. Oh, you hit that one real good. Well, Still I didn't, I didn't I didn't never, I didn't control most of players would have just played the clean, but uh, I had never oh, thought about playing the Caramel Oh, you hit that one real good. I think I miscued there. I didn't, I didn't never, well, it was straight in, and it was, you know, five inches away from the pocket, so that's a, that's a very common one in this queue. Yeah, I think I'm in the draw loads of left, and it's going the other way. Well, it was straight that Mercedes one in the queue, that's all I'm saying. Five inches away from the pocket, so that's a very common one in this queue. Wow, how would he hit that one? I have no idea what my reel is going to do. He's going to be jacking up here. I can't jack up, I've got a bad shoulder. I have no idea what my reel is Your entire life is a jack up. Jacking up here. Don't undercut it. Up. I've got a bad shoulder. Oh, what a shot. Are you watching these, are you watching these balls in the middle of the pockets? I could be playing on three-inch pockets, pal. Not your five-and-a-half-inch pockets. Well, from what your wife said, you're very good with three inches, so... Yeah, I know what I'm doing with three inches. Not your five-and-a-half-inch pockets. Some people don't like, like it that wide. I'm not allowed to talk about his cat, but you can talk about my wife. Well, you yeah, some people don't you like it that wide. So. <laughs> hey, you went there first. I just went first. I'm not allowed to talk about his cat, but you can talk about my wife. Well, you yeah, think that Are you worried yet, mate? I was worried the moment I decided to do this, Jim. How are you going to play this, Jim? I quite well. I think I'll just go forward. I'll just go forward with two reels and come down on the line here. I was worried. A real player would four rail this boss, Jim. Yeah, I'm not a real player, as you keep telling me. I think I'll just go I'll just Luckily, you have that sliding clock, so you can get the second diamond here on the right player with four rail this boss, Jim. Yeah, I'm not a real player, as you keep telling me. I think I'll just go forward. Luckily, you have that sliding clock, so you can get the second diamond here on the right player with four rail. What do you say, Jim? Another two rail, or are you just going to use one? Uh, I'll go two. Go there and here and back out. Yeah. You might want to grab your extension. No, no, I'll probably overhit this because the table's so quick. Yeah, that's probably true. I'll go two. Just watch out for that uh, that magic rack. It's on the no, table. No, I'll probably overhit this. <laughs> Can I get a ruling? Oh. <laughs> Can I get a ruling on that? <laughs> Can I get a ruling on that? <laughs> 
We are in for a long night, gents. It's me and Neil. We've been we 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 lower this to a race to five, Jim? <laughs> okay, hold on. Before, before you break, Nate, uh, give a shout-out to uh, Jake Ashbury for the uh, 99 uh, stars that were sent. And I can release for Okay, hold on. Before, before you break, Nate, uh, give a shout-out to uh, Hughes, Nathan Johnson, and Travis Richardson. Thank you so much for your donations. Uh, I got some from Venmo here. Let me, uh, let me, let me shout them out quick too while we're at it. How about you just hurry up and break? <laughs> Okay. Uh, Mike Gaines, thank you very uh, much. Seth, Seth White, thank you very much. Uh, Dom Dunn. No, nope, never mind. He bought you oh, no. Yeah, Dominic Dunn, 40 okay. bucks. Thank you very much. Uh, Mike Gaines, uh, Cody Wedding, thank you very much. Matt Kitzman, thank, thank you very much. Dom Jesus, Dunn. we need to do this more often, Jim. Oh, no, we never get this kind of donation. Yeah, Dominic Dunn, 40 bucks. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And then we have Cody Wedding, thank Jeff you very much. Borman as well. Thank you very much. Dominic Dunn again. We never get this kind of donation. And then Ian uh, Sitchin. Oh, yeah. Mate, have you remembered your playing? Uh, hey, hey, Mark, did you remember to shut the hell up? He's got a show to I'm sorry, Mark, I didn't mean that. Mark, I, I'm sorry, I did not mean that. I apologize for the things I said. I was angry. I just want to say, uh, I just want to say uh, thanks to Naina for the 99 red balloons as well. I'm sorry, Thank you very much. All right, off we go. I was angry. I just want to say, I just want to say thanks to Naina for the 99 red balloons as well. Thank you very much. All right, off we go. Oh, oh, how many were we making on the break? I'm going to try all of them. I can't shoot them in. Three balls. So. You can't lose this match. Oh, Tiny. oh. That's how all pockets, that table. All of them. I can't shoot them in. There is actually more pocket than rail, isn't there? Is it? Is it crazy? My God, Tiny. That's all pockets, that table. All of them. There is actually more pocket than rail, isn't there? Is it, is it Jim, why you gotta be so rude? I'm just enjoying watching you play, mate. It's an honour. I was watching him. Jim, why you gotta be so rude? He's actually a very good player, mate. I didn't realise he was this good. Neither did he. Jim, why you gotta be so rude? Yeah, mate. <laughs> How are we going to get through this? <laughs> Not very well. <laughs> oh, I'm in a fucking public... Oh, i sorry. I'm in a public pool room. Everyone's going to feel crazy. Not very well. <laughs> Yeah, yeah just hear someone in the background too oh, late. Sorry, I'm in a public pool room. Everyone's gonna be crazy. Not very well. That's, that's really funny. Man, the fact he's tried yeah, to hide these wearing the headphones. I think you should just stop it there and go around through your rails for position. Really. That's, really that's really funny. You're on the shoot, man. That eight ball's big if you run through it. Because he's a bit nervous. That eight ball's big. Oh! Why would you run on the way in? To be honest, Jim, you got me again. You made me laugh. Oh, you rattle a ball from that bucket. To be honest, Jim, you got me again. You made me laugh. Oh, you rattle a ball from that This is very difficult. This is like the true test of a champion right here. You can have the Moscone Cup. Try playing when you're laughing after every other shot. This is very difficult. This is like the true test of a champion. Got a good action with the cue ball there. You can have the Moscone Cup. Well, I don't have slippery cloth. I got actually put a stroke on a ball to miss it. Same you don't have one. Well, this is like the true test of a champion. Got a good action with the cue ball there. And there you have it. Oh, wait, where's the cue ball? Where's the cue ball? Oh, you got lucky. Awesome. So we have Cat Daddy Big Dad. Where's the cue ball? I think I'm just going to quit. I'm going to quit ahead. I'll talk to you guys later. So we have Cat Daddy Big Dad. Where's the cue ball? Oh, Jim with the two top, too much top spin scratches on the break. Immediately back over to Nate. Hey, Jim, I got a question for you. How'd you, how'd you, how'd you, how'd you hit that ball? I hit it pretty well. I hit it pretty well. I hit it good. I hit it good. Hey, uh, next time, can you make your inning a little bit longer so I have enough time to rack? How'd you hit that ball? I hit it pretty well. It's good for you, it's it's good for you to move good. quickly. Get rid of some I know I need to get that exercise. Uh, next time, I, 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 just want, I just want you two to know that you have 82 people watching on Facebook, so how awesome is that? I know I need to get that. 82 people that have nothing to do with their freaking life. That's what we I'm not going to lie. I'm sorry. I love everybody. Don't don't take anything I said first. Then, I, I just got angry. We also we also got uh, <laughs> seven people over on YouTube watching. I'm sorry. I love everybody.
don't don't take that comment which has gone down to 62 mate oh no jim look at this i'm sorry oh no oh well that's you don't have you don't have everything hanging over pocket no he's got he's got to work for this one no this is nasty. No. And a 5.7 is almost wired. Oh, Wait, it's a distance between them. Oh, there's not enough distance between them. It goes in the top right, I think, the five, doesn't it? And a 5.7 is no. almost doesn't go anywhere. Doesn't it must be great right. for the viewers that Nate, Nate's talking oh, through this. Everyone gets, the, gets an idea of what's right. going through uh, an idiot's head no. while he's looking at the table. Oh, my God. I wish I, 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 wish I had cheese. I wish I had cheese. Does it go? Uh, an idiot Are you banking it? No, no, it doesn't go. I got a bank. I wish, well, I wish I had cheese. I think I'm going to have to play the five, the, the one, you the seven, five combo, or the carom. Because, no, I can't do anything with the five ball either. Well, I wish I had I think I'm going to have to play the five Let's go on with it, will you? Whatever, I'll just bank it in. Run out, champion. I can't do anything with the five ball either. Well, I wish I had to play the five. Go on with it, will you? Just kidding. Oh, I played a good safety on myself. Run out. Well done. Like a champion. Very good safety. Like a champion. Like a champion. Just kidding. Oh, I played a good safety on myself. Good Jimmy. Good crack. Watch out for that. Watch out for the magic rack Very good safety. I got you last. Like a champion. Oh, 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 oh almost, oh, almost scratched again. Did you make enough balls on the break, though? Oh, flying and everywhere. Oh, wow, with those pockets. Oh, almost scratched again. Did you make enough balls on the break, though? smaller than you of me. Oh, flying and everywhere. So, shout out to Yorn Kaplan, who's watching from Facebook, saying, have fun, guys, and this is a world-class match. Oh, smaller than you of me. Wow. Wow. It is called the Idiot Pickle, the Idiot Pickle Cup, or whatever. Whatever the heck oh, it's called. Classic. We're not sure what it's called, but <laughs> it's it involves it involves it idiot. It's called the, it, the idiot pickle, the idiot pickle chop cup, or whatever the heck it's called. Jesus. We're not sure what it's called. Shout out to uh, Carly McGee. Thank you so much for your donation. And Sarah Schmidt. Thank you so much for your donation. Shout out to. What is even happening at this point? Not as quick as I think. Sarah Schmidt. Said no woman who's ever done a thing. Not as quick as a thing. Not as quick as a thing. Getting sharp by my own table. Said no woman who's ever done a thing. Not as quick as a thing. Not as quick as a thing. Getting sharp by my own table. Said no woman who's ever done a thing. Man, this is a test. This, this is a two railer, no? Or are you going to try to force it with some inside spin? No, I think Jim will just probably go. I think Jim will just go one yesterday, rail right into the corner pocket. Man, this is a test. Yesterday, right. I had a play, yesterday, I had to spun it in here and here and come out here, but now it's going to no, spin think down all the way. I think ah, Jim will just go yeah, one rail right. I think if, I think if you go just a yeah, just a tiny bit under center, I think that's your shot. No, I think what I'm right into that top left corner. I'm, I'm going to come out here and here and find I think, it I think if you go just a Ooh, just a tiny bit under center, we try to get into the corner pocket first. I think what I'm going right into that top left corner. I'm going to come out here and here and find it. Great shot. Where's the key bolt? Oh, how did he hit it? Right on the seven. Great shot, Jim. Great shot. Well, I think it, you could hold this cue ball if you played the seven oh, off the ten. Right, <laughs> <laughs> great shot, yeah. This is the Nate Mendham I know, calling all the right shots. Well, I think it, you could hold this cue ball if you played the Well, he seven calls all the right ones, so you could play right, something different, right? So you could actually play this yeah. one correctly. This is the Nate Mendham I know, calling all the right shots. Well, he calls all the right ones, so you could play something different, right? So you could actually play this one correctly. Oh, oh, he's no straight angle. Going, isn't he? oh. Straight beginning to. Oh. Oh. Just take your medicine on this one, right? You don't do anything fancy. I think you may no. be right, Chris. But no, today, is, today, is not the day, today is not the day to not do fancy things. Come on, Jim. Four rounds. Come on. I think Come on. You no. Right. Like a Polaroid picture. He's going for it. One, two. Come on, Jim. Oh, is he going to scratch? He's going to scratch? Where's no, the cue no, ball going? No, Where's no, the cue no, ball going? No. Five rails. You made the fifth rail. Two. Shot. Come on, three. Oh, he's gonna going scratch? level. He's going to scratch? Where's no. the cue ah. ball going? Oh. Oh. We've got a match. We've got, got a match. Finally. Come on, three. Oh, he's going to average the best. Where's the cue ball going? Okay, I need to beat you. We've got a match. Average the best. Average the best. Average the best will beat you every time. Probably. We've got a match. Average your best. <laughs> average your best. Average your best will beat you every time. 
Probably. <laughs> spread off that break. I'm so lucky we break. Probably. Jim, when you hit the balls as good as I do, you need to get lucky. <laughs> I mean, you don't, uh, what? Yeah, uh, uh. Jim, when you hit the balls as good as I do, you need to get lucky. Please, Nate's fine. Or Cat Daddy. I mean, you don't, uh, <laughs> Don't leave yourself too much angle in one, too, eh? I know. Please, I'm worried about that. I'm going to probably or Cat Daddy just freeze in the back of the eight ball. <laughs> Ten balls, big if you leave too much don't angle. Too much angle one, too, eh? Oh no, what have you done? I'm worried about that. I'm going to probably right. cat this is This is quite off to because it seems like the white travel really quickly, quickly but and then it's jumping and just stop. Oh no, what have you done? I'm worried about that. I'm going to probably cat that. Oh wow. It seems like the white travel Mark, take over for a second while I. I'd like a referee. I'd like a referee. Okay, mate. Nice nice cue ball control there from Nate, leaving himself a nice cue in. Played. That was the only way to get natural position. Played it well for the game. Nice, nice cue ball control. Just a little draw shot here, probably. Nice cue in. I'll probably go forward now. Played. That was the only way to get natural position. He's going to have to play it well. Go forward. God, these tables must be strong. He's putting all his weight on that. I'll probably go forward now. Played. That was the only way to get natural position. Did he foul? He's going to have to play it well. Go forward. I think there's too many balls on the table, if that's what you're trying to say. I'll probably go forward now. Played. Did he foul? You can't do it. I tell you what, these, these diamonds are well made. Strong, sturdy tables. I had to reinforce the table just for you, Jim. I was going to say, if that, if that table doesn't have a roll on it now, then Jesus. It looks, it looks like a bum's wick when he's playing on it. Mm. I don't get it. Oh, he's playing well. I think I'm, is that not a foul leaving your ref on the table like that, no? There was a little little turn on that cue ball then as it approached the little bit of dirt. Yeah, I, had, I had some left hand spin on it. Unintentional, obviously. <laughs> Clearly. Does this go to the side pocket? Oh, it's so thin. But good thing these pockets are five and a half inches. Exactly, yeah. Your pro cut pocket. Yeah, but the uh, the table at the Masters is looking pretty tight, isn't it, Jim? Oh my God, that looks so stupid. I think it's good to see, don't you, Jim? Uh, yeah, I don't mind it. I don't mind the, the the deep shelf on it. I just think that the table itself played a bit dodgy. That was all. It was very bouncy. It just wasn't a very nice table to play on. I think. Well done, Cat Daddy. Not bad. Not bad. Even for you. Thanks. Uh, I'll pay you later, Mark, for distracting him long enough so I didn't start laughing and dog the nine ball. You didn't play the nine ball, you idiot. I'm colorblind. Hey, watch out for that side pocket, Jim. It gets bigger the longer you play. Especially well, that sliding you, I was going to say, you've obviously been on, on that table for a while then. Pockets have grown substantially. Have you broken the balls yet, Ivan? No! Oh, oh, no. Scratch. <laughs> Look at the balls are lying as well. There's no way I'm getting out of that rack anyway. Well, I mean, you barely get out of any racks to begin with. Jim, I don't, I don't play ten ball that much, but I don't think the cue ball is supposed to fall on the break. Listen, I don't mind, I don't mind him giving me shit, but you need to shut your mouth. <laughs> Right, uh, I hope we're not paying these people, Nate. <laughs> oh, yeah. Of course not. All right. So uh, shout fun? out to uh, David Davison for letting me know there was some audio issues on YouTube, but those should be fixed. And shout out to hey, hey, Lil, Stephen Hall Lil Chris, for his donation. Well, Chris, it's, it's, been, uh, it's been eight seconds. I know Jim can't be playing. Are you on my table yet? <laughs> yes, I'm on your table. You're good to go, bud. Okay. I just wanted to make sure. I, I mean, I, normally after eight seconds, Jim's done shooting. So I just wanted to make sure I'm ready to go. <laughs> There's no point in trying to shark me when I'm not actually playing any shots. You're just wasting all your best lines. <sighs> oh, yes, I got saved. I was going to scratch. You got lucky again, did you? Yeah, I did there. Cue ball's going right into the heart of the pocket. All right, everybody. I'm going to give you a trip into the matrix here. He likes these long ones down there. He doesn't like screwing the ball down, does he? No, I don't, Jim. He loves he loves awkward queuing though. Yeah, he loves losing himself over balls. Thank you. What's wrong with this? Oh, he's okay. Yeah. You think I'd have done that? You think I'd have put it right there if it was going to be awkward queuing? I know what I'm doing. Almost. <laughs> almost. 
Probably going to follow this. Nah, no, that's a definite draw stroke. I was just, I was just playing with him. <clears throat> I'm going to come over to America and play in these seven foot tables. You couldn't handle the clusters. Plus, yeah, you've had loads of them, haven't you? One. Uh, if I remember correctly, aren't you coming to New York or something soon? I'm going to come over to the States whenever I can get the chance, yeah. Okay. Nate, you look like you've played the score now is, before. Is it like six to six to one? What's the score now? I think it's three one if you knock this ten in. Yeah. Sorry, is, I, I, is, I guess that, is that I must big, be reading the future. Is that a big if? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on, side pockets, help me out. Oh, you, you want to? Not again. Oh, again. <laughs> Nate, I'm so freaking. I don't care what you say anymore. Oh, hold on, hold on, because if you if you want to talk about future. Because when I advertised this on my uh, YouTube community wall, we had uh, someone comment saying it's going to be 9495 Jim if they're playing on a nine foot table. Oh, I don't think I can get to four. <laughs> I don't have access to a nine foot table, really. And the only place I do has really bad internet, but I, need, I still need the handicap. Jim, you know I love you, right? Yeah, fucking stupid break. <laughs> <laughs> what is your true Fargo then, Nate? Uh, 543. 667. And what's 666, yours? I went back what's down. What's yours, Jim? 723, I think, last time I looked. I got saved again. Of course this you is did. clean living. This is clean living. I'm just going to stand here and drink wine. I'm only going to be breaking and then drinking. That's the only thing I'm going to be doing for the next two hours. Well, if you... If you... Have you tried not scratching in the side? Yeah, I do try that quite often. Still doesn't help. Here you go. I'm going to screw this one back just for you, Mark. I might okay. actually try. I might actually try and scratch on my next break. See Mind the eight ball. Ooh, now we get uh -oh. to do something fun. Uh oh, are you pattern are you racking? Are you using the same rack, you guys, or is it a different? Yeah, same rack. Yeah, we're using oh, okay. the, the group stage rack. Okay. I've just noticed a pattern developing. That's probably oh, that's no good. That's going to be short, oh. surely. Bank shot. Easy bank, easy bank. Oh, I missed the bank that way short. Oh, I thought you were really? going for the I thought you were going for the Josh Fuller three railer. <laughs> oh, God. And that that bank's really short. Why did that bank so short? That was weird. All right, come on, side. Oh, wait, you're soft breaking now. That wasn't a soft break. Look at that cue ball go. Oh, he's is, still is, going for the side pocket. I'm is it a dry Jim. break? Nope, the four ball goes. <laughs> Damn it. Sorry, Jim, I wasn't rooting against you. I just was, wasn't rooting for you. Oh, shut up, you tub. <laughs> I might even let you have one so, it's so uh, we can keep this match close. <laughs> oh, Nate, Nate, Nate. I don't think I could run. I still don't think I can run five more racks, so, or six more racks, whatever I need. Oh, a wanky two ball. Kind of a crappy six ball, too. Six oh, too I guess the four ball's right there. Yeah, the, the four three, ball's right four, there. Six is pretty easy. It's getting on the two. Oh, it goes by the 10, surely. Yeah, I know, but I don't trust the speed of this table. If I could play it in the if I could play it in the middle, then I would do it. But we'll just draw it off the bottom cushion, and play it in this right middle. Well, does a three pass the nine? Looks like it. It does, yeah. Okay. Yeah, easy game. What are you whining about all the time for? <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, Nate, get up. Uh, get up. Laura Berg wants to know if you, if the mental part counts as a handicap. Um, no, because I didn't wear my helmet. <laughs> I have to give a shout out to um, Ian. Nope, Ian already got one. He can have another one. Ian gets another shout out. Um, somebody donated by uh, Venmo. Who was it? Who was it? The world may never know. It was David Davidson. Thank you very much, David Davidson. Oh, and Ryan Harmson, too. Oh, you know, Jim, you can play this game when uh, when you don't dog the balls on the break all the time. We've got the lovely Nada Hoffman with a very generous donation. Thank you so much. Hi, Nada. He's gone all, um, he's gone all feather on us. Oh, look at Jim. that draw action. The old, Anybody yeah, can the draw old, on a uh, new table. He's starting to drop the elbow. Lovely. Normally only does that because his baby widow shoulder hurts. <laughs> Calvin Post says he uh, he wishes that the, there was this kind of trash talking in the matchroom events. <laughs> there is, but we're all sitting in the crowd. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, beautifully done, Jim. Oh, Not Jim, letting you just, get away quite yet, Nate. Not you're just such a talent, Jim. Quite. You are just such a talent. Good to be appreciated. Who's doing the scoreboard? Anyone? I am. Well, oh, Chris. Not Nate, not Nate, thankfully. I bet it's, I bet it's up to date. I bet it's, yeah, I bet it's right. It is, exactly. 3-2, <laughs> right? Yep. You're going to get saved again? No. Oh, look at this. His ball's dropping five. everywhere. Oh, look five at the 5-10. Oh, that's a shame. Got it for you. Are you? Nope. He's got an uh, easy breakout from the, from the three ball. Don't give him hints. He never Where saw he, that. Why has he put the cue ball there? Because he's an idiot. He's just gonna gently. He's gonna gently draw off of this for position for the three in the side so that they can try to break I'd out the box. I'll be playing the three. I'll be playing three into the top. Yeah, oh, we tried to break it out three. now. Never mind. That's, that's oh, I ran on the shot. way the wrong side. What of that. a silly shot. Oh, we're gonna see the great Nate jump here. Are you on the three ball now, Nate? Oh, good yeah. luck. I want to see oh, the shot to get the five out. Have you got yourself? Have you got your one of these Jokovi blackouts? You need that no problem. Oh, maybe eight. Oh, uh, was... yeah, Nate, Nate's got to go to the other end of the room now to co collect his ball. <laughs> That's the most exercise he gets, I think. Oh, my yeah. goodness. <clears throat> what an idiot. Played a nine-foot jump on a seven-foot table. <laughs> Sad. Are you soft-breaking, Jim? No. Well, I'll try to hit it over 13 miles an hour then. Oh, that side pocket, buddy. No. The quarter pocket. Oh. <laughs> He's good. Did he get away with it? He did. He did. Oh, oh yeah, because you, you haven't got away with anything yet. <laughs> such a bad player. I'm a bad breaker. I admit it. I'm terrible at breaking. A good pool player would control those cue balls. Yeah, I know. I'm not. <laughs> Is it wide open too? Nah, wide. I wouldn't call it wide. So it's not like Jim in college wide? He's got quite yeah. a few uh, transitions he's got to do uh, going up and down the table. I think the, it looks like the, yeah. the four to the. Uh, no, never mind. The, I forgot. It's the pink four, purple five. Pink four, purple five. <clears throat> yeah, that gap between the, uh, the eight and ten is a pretty tight one hit for position on the two. I was actually watching your YouTube channel the other day, Chris. The, the one with the camera on the queue, the, the difference between the two cameras. Quite interesting. Oh, thank you. I'm, uh, I'm going to be making more of those. Yeah, I like them. I like the player's eye view. <clears throat> Which camera do you favor? Have you got a Well, a I, like the, I like the Ordro better because it's lighter. Um, but I, I don't like that. It, it, I have it mounted directly on the queue, so that way every queue hit basically vibrates the I got the a camera. shot clock on Jim. Shut your mouth. <laughs> so, but I, I have a mount uh, for my Ordro now that I can I can mount it to my queue just like how I did the uh, the GoPro. So I'm gonna try to see what that looks like. Um, Ooh, is that gonna get there? And see what the weight feels yes, like. Yes, it's gonna get there. Okay. Well, well, if I'm gonna get it back again, though. You just go forward with it, right? 
No, not with these rails. It's never going to. No, it's never going to take. It's never going to take and come this way. Ah, you gotta. I think you should just cross the two ball up in the corner. It'll help you get your cue ball going. No, I think if I can just miss the eight, then I'll come around here for the middle pocket. If I can just miss the eight. Laura, he does get us. He does get a handicap. He's playing against me. No, nah, couldn't miss the eight. Uh, is it three past the six? No, you actually far enough. You can cut that. Yeah, cut all the combo. Probably the combo. Uh, the combo is way too tough. Right oh, shot. how'd he hit that? Needs another one. Got a lucky roll, too. Should have been hooked. Mm -mm. I jumped. I've got a proper break you. Uh, jump you. Sorry. Not that duck that you use. I'd have made that jump shot if I wasn't so nervous. I'll ask Kelly Fisher if she can give you some lessons on jumping, Nate. Feel free. <laughs> Nate, Nate should avoid jumping. Have you seen the size of him? If Nate was to if Nate was to physically jump into the air, he'd get stuck. Oh my goodness! It's very rude. I know. It's all this easier, timing. There's an easier Wait. shot than this, but I'm, I, I want to play the trickier one. Is he playing in the corner. Hopefully, it's the one where you shut up and shoot. Wow. Nicely done. Oh yeah, that was really tricky. <laughs> so no, from... no respect, none whatsoever. That was a good shot, you idiot. It's a good thing you got that slippery cloth. You hit the first diamond. Oh, and then no. clean in the middle. You're blind. I'm <laughs> stupid. <laughs> oh, got a hold of that one. Lovely draw action. Yeah. <clears throat> Average at best. If I took 45 minutes per shot, too, I could be able to do that. To be honest, Nate, you've got a third of the less table to go as well, though, to do a draw like that. You don't have to worry about my stroke, buddy. It exists. I hope we see it soon. Yeah, hurry up and show us it. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get oh, to see it at some point in time oh, if Jim ever shoots. Can't reach oh, my God. Was that the table squealing or was that Jim? No, that was me. That was my shoulder squealing. I can't stretch. <laughs> Richie's coming out. The rest. Oh, the, oh, the proper break. rest. The proper crest, crosshead rest. Lovely to see, Jim. I think the best way to, uh, to win this match is to just take four hours. Question for you, Nate. That's why a good shot, you, Jim. Why don't you have them on all pool tables? They're such a much better rest, those crossheads. Because uh, I only play on four-foot pool tables. We don't need them here. <laughs> that's the truth. Sure. That's, just, that's the one true thing he said since we went live. And with that rack, we're all tied up three to three. So Fred really, gets, am I? I'm, yeah. Am I not? Am I not losing all the rubbish that I've played and all these scratches? And I'm not even losing. Not yet. Holy. Jesus, you're rubbish, Nate. <laughs> but uh, uh, Fred Didsmore in the chat says uh, he's just got home and he wants to know what's happening. So you are watching an ex a long talked uh, yeah a long talked about exhibition match between <sighs> Nate Cat Daddy Mendum and Jim Bagpipes Telfer. We've all watched them and heard them do their commentary on both the VG10 and VG9 in the Battle of the Sexes. We've even got to see uh, Jim perform uh, in the uh, in the events. That's what and, you want to call it. Yeah. <laughs> And then so now we get to actually see them square off against each other. They're playing a best out of three sets where each set is a race to nine. A oh. marathon, basically. This is going to be tricky. Oh, boo -hoo, do you have to actually play some position, Nate? Yeah, I know. I wish I broke. I, were, I wish I had luck like you. I All the balls can just get, put a, He can come between fell me. In. He can just miss the seven here, I think, off the side rail twice across. Get down to this that six bottom, ball bottom rail. I don't think he even dares to mess with the six ball. Yeah, I don't think so. Good speed, oh, that, Nate. Good speed. Yeah, Thanks, Jim. Is, actually. Appreciate that. These you want are to see me miss the, the shot? No, these are, but I'm, just, no, I'm trying to give you advice. These are always thinner than you think. 
Sure. Playing with lots of left. What chalk are you using, mate? Russian magic. Should I say Fedor magic? <clears throat> Nicely done there. That ball skid. Uh oh. That ball skid. Oh, got uh -oh. a little, bit, Always. Of, got a little right. bit of cling action there between the cue ball and the object ball. Good. That ball skid. I, 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 think it's a, I think it's a good time to talk about the manscape. Got to keep your balls clean. <laughs> that ball skid. Oh, <laughs> oh, I'm going to grab the new balls. At least you'll be happy. Oh, well, Nate goes off to wash his balls. Jim. <laughs> Two ball again. Yeah, struggling with that two ball. Oh. Garbage. Might be able to get on it though, Jim, and just to left the centre table, maybe. As we look. It's got to be something a little bit cheekier than that, surely. Don't worry, I'm on my way back from grabbing a new set of balls. I'll help you. Got to be a cheeky shot here somewhere. What do we have here? What do we have here? Um, well, two passes to six, doesn't it? So just play, uh, play, play the one into the bottom right corner, come off the right cushion, and just come in between the three and the ten. No, I'm doing it, Mario. I'm going to draw it back into the into that. Position. Oh, I thought the, yeah, I thought the four ball covered it up. Yeah, that's the right shot. And if I hit the ten, I'm also good. Just make sure you get it there. Don't underdraw it. That's common. I hit the 10, I'm also good. Yep. Unless you get hooked oh, or jacked up over the three. Oh, oh, that's, that's oh. pure. I can't even talk shit about that. That's a shot worth hitting right there. Oh, I'm going the wrong angle on it. Mm, you've got to be careful here, though. Well, the three ball's not in a terrible spot. It's whether he slides past the seven or not, though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go past the seven. And yeah. it's tight to... Jack up on it. Yeah, he's got to jack up if he wants to stun into the seven. So I'll try having a skid ball. Could play it into the top left though, Jim, I guess. So I do that then, Mark. So I'll play it in the top yeah. left. Yeah, put it in the top left. Uh, I'll do that then. <laughs> it's probably just as easy, right? Did you make it? Oh, what a oh, shot. How do you what hit a it? shot. What a shot. How do I win it? Straight. Nice little angle as well here to get up for the four, hopefully. You think? <laughs> is it straight, is it? Oh, I can make something, out maybe. Just, can make just something out of it. Just make something out of it, I think. Power draw it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Or power First stun angle. it. Wow. <laughs> you don't, don't, don't go straight either. Oh, oh my goodness. These <laughs> tight pockets. That should that would have gone in on Nate's table. <laughs> Keep it going, Jim. This is a good out. This. Another good shot. Oh, that was a yeah. That was a great shot. I got to rack the balls. And that tattoo there on Jim's arm, I've got that on my leg actually. That tattoo. Did you guys get matching tattoos in Vegas? No, I've never been to Vegas. I'm going there in sometime this year. Well, it's not the same as mine because mine's my daughter's birthday. I was going to say, I feel, yeah. a bit, I feel a bit weird if you had my daughter's birthday tattooed on me. <laughs> Oh, is it? I thought it was 8, 9, and 10. Sorry. Well, it's 11, 12, 13. My daughter ah, must okay. Well, 13, 12, 11. Yeah. Okay. Oh, 
Skiddy. Skiddy table. Yeah, we've got to watch the slide here as well off the side rail, isn't he? Oh, you whore. That was a hard oh, shot, though. Goodness. Very difficult, especially on a new cloth and rails, wasn't it? Difficult. Yeah. Oh, for some reason, your table's gone small far. There we go. No? Bonus points for not taking ball in hand, right? Sure, why not? We're just making this up as we go along, aren't we? Yeah, basically. <clears throat> I'm really only moving at about a quarter of an inch. What's going on in the chat? Anything, Chris? I've lost mine for some reason. No, I've got it back. Yeah. Uh, it looks like everybody's having a good time in the chat. Well, an eye on you. Maybe remind them about the the donations for the Moscone Cup tickets, Chris. Uh, I'm gonna have to have Nate uh, talk about that when he's done shooting. Okay, no, do it now, Nate, while you're shooting. <clears throat> okay. Um, all of the donations that we get in from today's um, stream is going to be going towards buying the Cue It Up podcast section of the Moscone Cup, their tickets. So if we raise $1,000, we are putting $1,000 towards buying tickets for everybody who goes in the queued up section. The only disclaimer is you have to donate to the total pool to be able to partake in the pool. So watch the pool. Nice. Good shot, man. Oh, yeah. And... Um, we're giving away, for all the people who donate, we're giving away a $1,300 Jacoby Custom Q, and whoever donates the most amount of money, so Lil Chris, you might have to track that, um, you're going to get a free break you. $200 uh, poison break you. Well, I can only track the uh, the PayPal ones. I can't track the other ones. I can track the other ones. I think Dominic Dunn is pretty high up there. I think he's at like 65. So that's the highest that I have. Um, I've got way more than that. <laughs> oh, is that not a? Yeah. You said something about that earlier, yeah. Oh, that was a poor shot. You know, I was not thinking about that at all. I honestly was playing position for the 10 ball next, and I forgot about the 9 ball. That was a poor idea. Oh, that was really so You mentioned Notta. She's actually asking if all players complain about their tables as much as you do, Nate. And Jim. Me? I haven't complained. I'm gonna say I haven't complained about mine yet. I'm not besides complaining about mine. I'm just I'm not complaining about mine. I'm just letting people know the situation. That's not a complaint. I, just, I yeah. love I love my table. I just had the skid balls all. Get off the rail. Well, Get off the rail. Well, Nate, you got a pro tip from uh, William Larson on YouTube. It says never start a match with dirty balls. Fair play. There you go. But that was a great shot on the eight. No, it wasn't. It was a fuck terrible shot. Dead straight in and jacked up. Swear you potty mouth. Oh, oh I, mind, I oh. mind your language. We're live. I, I do have just a roll in, I'm sorry. Just roll it in and take the long ten. Yeah, just take the medicine on this baby. one. It's not exactly it's not even a, it's not even a long ten. Oh, how'd he hit that though? Not even a long ten. Oh, keyboard. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Beautifully oh. done, Nate. Beautifully done. Nate, you've now reclaimed the lead. Score is currently <laughs> four to three. All right, Jim. Jim, I'm taking the under on one and a half on your break for a dollar. Oh, he's made the six just. And you got the under. <laughs> wow. Am I, gonna get, am I just going to get one? just got a decent two ball. I don't care. I don't care if you're going out now. I got a dollar. You didn't get nothing off me. I haven't made the bet with you. Sure. I told you I was taking it. Don't bite me. 
Oh, just give me one decent shot on a two ball. I still cannot believe that you said that when they gave me my uh, my COVID shot that gravy came out. That was really rude. <laughs> Quick question for you, Jim, from Steve Hall. He says, um, what is your initial reaction to your new Jacoby Q? It, uh, it's different, is my reaction to it. I like the feel of it, but it does play different to my Predator, so it's going to take a little bit of adjusting to. But I'm not... Uh, I've only played with it for a, I've only I haven't played with it much to be honest because of my shoulder. But uh, I love the way it feels and the way it looks. I didn't know you had a bad shoulder, Jim. Yeah, I've ripped a muscle down the left hand side of my neck. It's what happens? It's what happens when you turn sixty. Things start failing. Oh jeez. Yeah. Oh, you're a dick. I feel like with how much heckling we're doing, that's a great shot, Jim. I was going to say, I was, I was gonna say is, there, is, is nobody going to say something about that shot? <laughs> Very good shot. I'll give you that. All right, I'll give is you that. Is nobody going to say something about that shot? We oh have to God. wait for you night people, to stop you people, there's no, There's no keeping you people happy, really. It's fucking disgusting. I feel like with how much we're just ripping each other apart, I feel like there really should be like a, um, like Moscone Cup ranking points for this. I think has nobody done the hearts and thumbs up to see who people want to want to see? No, oh, nobody's that's done that yet. That's a great idea. So yeah. No, it's not. <laughs> My little heart can't handle the rejection. Jim's everybody's favorite. <laughs> so let, let's I'm see a, here. I'm a crowd favorite. I'm a crowd favorite. Okay. Let's Everybody have, loves let's Jim. Let's have um, pickles. Let's have pickles for for Jim and um, big fat peaches for <laughs> for Nate. We're, 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 we're going to do, do it this way. If you want Jim to win this exhibition match, give us a thumbs up. And if you want Nate to win, give us the care reaction. The care? That's farther away. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, no, give him the one that nobody knows where it is. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's under fruit and veg. Nate would never find that. Yeah. <laughs> Chips and fucking gravy, fine. <laughs> Go to the fast food section. God, I hope I... <laughs> Should have gone for the McDonald's fries carton for, for Nate. Yeah. Jim, I think I'm winning. I think I won. Shit, this table is alive. It's fucking hell. Have you thought about not hitting the ball so bad? Uh, somebody's, uh, Patrick Neal is asking what time is the cutoff for the donations tonight, Nate? Do um, when I put no, the last 10 ball about no, midnight it's, no it's going to be a while no it's going to be a while um, you can donate all the way up until I do the drawing and I probably won't do the drawing until this weekend I got a oh, lot of okay. I got a lot of things coming up tonight and tomorrow okay I'll either do it Saturday or Sunday nice how'd you like that rock how'd you like that rock cat daddy Saturday or Sunday that was okay three to four won it for you Jim <laughs> <sighs> Are we level still? We're tied up I think again. So. Four, yep. four, four, four. four. I've had, I've Jim, four I can't handle this level of pressure. I'm not clutch like you. I've had four scratches for Christ's sake. How can I still be level? Ooh. Grabbing that before it falls. This is kind of stinky. Might play the combo here. One six, maybe. He doesn't like combo two. I hate combos. He's going to have to play. I think he's got no choice. As Jim would say, play the combi. Combi. Oh, I got to do it too. Damn it! Do I? Come on! Come or, on! Or bank it in the. <sighs> no. To be fair, it really is one of the toughest combinations I've ever seen in my life. Crazy toughest combi. Shut up, Jim. This actually is really tricky. It's what? unmissable on you, this table. What, what I gotta hold the cue ball. At? It's you're unmissable. Ball. What, what you mean you've got to hit it just the low center? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that tough is it? All right then. See? It's hard. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. A little bit of pee just came out. You can still cut this. <laughs> Might even run into the two here off the rail. Oh. oh he flips oh. the nine. Oh. Come on, two oh, rails. Trouble. Two rails past the oh, eight ball, three, right hand three, English. Is that three ball in the way? I think he's, I think he's even got a bind of three ball, he goes as well. Oh, he oh. barely missed it. But he kicked Deserved a good that. field goal. Impossible to get through there. Deserved it. Deserved wow. that. 
chance, Jim, to go into the lead for the first time. <clears throat> Did Unbelievable. It Did it again. Oh, oh look at this. For Jim. I'm not using this brake cue anymore tonight. You, you How'd got, you hit that one, Jim? Yeah. I've got no control with this brake cue yet. You got you to gotta lay off the weights there, Jim. You're hitting them a little too hard. Yeah, Jim. Why don't you soft break like a real man? <laughs> Fuck my body. <laughs> I'm, just keep, I'm just keeping you in this, Nate. I know. <laughs> I hate combinations. I hate him, Jim. I got to practice. Jim, how do you get good at combinations? Just to let you know, Jim, we've got I Nate in the chat now, and he's actually just... Um put up the thumbs up for you to win. Oh, he knows what he's talking about. Yeah. Like time you scratched, no? No, oh, not yet. Give me a couple not, of minutes. Not even dry? No. Jesus. Jim, I know how to make a wing ball. I know how to make a wing ball. I just don't know how to get the weight in the table. That's fair. Yeah, you usually you use your cue balls as a wing ball most of the time. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> This, this, uh, I tell you what though, this Jacoby is lively. It's got a lot of power in it. I'm not quite, I've not quite got it under control yet. It's not getting anywhere close. That's a really bad shot. Oh, oh jump keys coming me in, in now. That's a really bad shot. You want to, you want to borrow my blackout? You might make one. Oh, and he makes it too, but he couldn't hold the cue ball. Wow. That's a really bad shot. I mean, that's like a, that's about as stupid as it gets. It's got to be a lot harder jumping on a seven footer, though. Surely. Is this dry? Dry. Oh my yes. god! Dry. Jim, switch back to the blackout. Oh, no, no, this was, the the cue ball. this was oh. a blackout. This was a blackout. I have no idea what I'm doing with the brick. Oh my goodness! I like your soft break, Jim. Yeah, I do, but Nate, Nate, the first thing Nate said was no soft brakes. No, I never said that. I Why? asked you if you wanted to use soft brakes, and you're like, no, you think it's more interesting, and I think it's more interesting. So don't put this on me, scooter butt. That's not exactly how the conversation went, but never mind. <laughs> <laughs> What's the score, However, anyway? It's still 4-4. Four, four. The score four, is four. still 4-4. Four to four. God, we suck at this, Nate. Oh, I missed it. I missed the wing ball. Oh, oh three ball. Yes. One ball. Oh, I made the two ball two. balls. I made the two one ball two. You made the two you made the two ball one. I made the one ball two. No. No, 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 no. Is that the four or the seven that's on that left hand reel? If it's the four, he's lucky. The seven. Is it the seven? Ah, ha, ha, ha. The five to the six is the work. No, the, the seven's on the rail, the four's sitting over the side pocket. That looks like a tea. No. You got terrible camera. You have terrible eyes. I get complimented with my eyes. I really don't know how to get from the five to the six. You gotta start talking about strategy. Just give up then. I can't. Little Chris might have an idea. Let's see, you're shooting the four in the side. Well, I could play the four somewhere else, but I think I'll probably play it to the side. Yeah, Can't but... You play a carom on the eight. Can't you get to the This is the eight? X. No. This is the... Can't you just... Uh, is the eight in the way if you stop the four? If you stop on the four? Eight in the way for what? You got no the... I got to play a position on the six ball next. Wrong angle, isn't it? Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, it's straight in. I mean, the best I could hope for is like draw back into the the draw jaw and have it rails, shoot it out the table. Twice across. Can you not? Can you not draw it underneath the 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 eight? Well, loads of left hand side and come up table for the six. I don't. No, the angle's going to be well, maybe. But the draw seven ball is going to be rail. Like tricky. Play, play the, the five. Question, the question is: the there. question is, do you have that stroke? Oh, well, let's find out. I can't believe I just helped him. See if you get out here. Well, that was the only shot that I saw, so... You probably missed the four. That was a tough one. Mm, awkward queuing as well now. 
Don't like that shot he's played. Wow, how well's he hit that one? What a Lee. Don't question my stroke. You hit that as hard as you possibly could. And Stop you still, it. And you still only moved the white ball five foot. Stop it. <laughs> now well, he's showing off. He's... Maybe a little bit straight. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Is that a scratch or is it going to have to be three or four rails with left hand side? Yeah, draw left hand English. Is he doing it? Yeah. You can be missed. Oh, I missed a bad. Oh, you missed a mile. <laughs> oh. oh, Jim, you talked me right into it. <laughs> talked me right into that. <laughs> I love this. I want to play oh, more of these matches. You talked me right into that one. Jesus. <sighs> can I talk you into scratching to the side? Might be able to. Oh, oh I was going to say, you could, him again. You, you could talk him into a dry break. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was just about to say the same thing, Chris. And I then did. Six got kicked in. Oh, the six ball went. Dirty. Yeah, yeah. I can't get uh, it's, it's the seven and the eight though looks looks nasty. The problem is I can get I can get straight enough over my playing cue, but I can't get straight over my break cue and put any sort of power in it. My shoulder starts jamming and doing funny things, so I'm just I'm not even hitting the center of the white ball on my break. He could leave himself an angle on the two here actually to screw into the off the rail into the eight and the seven, leave himself on the three. That's a possibility. You're mental. <laughs> Come on. You madman. What's the what's Crazy the man. diagnosis? The two passes, the eight, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is ugly. I'd be leaving myself an angle on the two here. Mm. Nah. I mean you theoretically could, but I mean that's I think you're Oh, I said the seven and the eight. That's the seven and the ten. Seven and the ten, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you're almost better off going. You're almost just better breaking. Uh, better. I think you're better off just breaking it up with a five ball and just hoping for the best. I mean, the the, the chance of you get breaking it out and getting a shot still on the three ball is not super high. <laughs> <clears throat> Super thin it and just run into the, seven, the bottom side yeah. of the seven ball so he hooks yeah. himself. He won't, though. <laughs> All about this shot now, then. Run at it again here if you wanted to, but it's not yeah, very I'm smart. Gonna, I would have done before I got the new cloth. I'm never going to get around it. It's going to stick on those rails. Oh, I mean, you could you could come off one rail back at it. Yeah. Or Maybe get off the, right about where your magic rack was. Just to answer Maybe. your question, uh, Ryan. Yeah, it's completely different. I mean, it's not even commentating. It's just having a laugh and seeing who can yeah, shout just... the loudest and say the, the most derogatory thing to each other. I think that's, uh, that's what this match is about. The goal is literally... Now, how was that more dangerous? How did he hit that one? Wow. That, that turned out okay. Well. A lot more dangerous than the other shot, I thought, but he played it well. Thank you to Laura Berg. This way, this way I'm more, ch more chance to get on the five. Playing the, playing the two into, the, into it, then I was, the three was sitting a bit dodgy for that. Okay. <clears throat> if the three was over the pocket, yeah, but on the rail here, yeah. Stinky. I think uh, I think to be fair, I don't think he was. I don't think uh, your plan was to break that up off the four ball from the beginning. Sorry, you weren't planning to break that out off the four ball from the beginning of the rack. I'm assuming. Yes, like, I was, but I wanted to be round about here with the cue ball. Oh, okay. Uh, and to further answer uh, Ryan Harmson's questions about commentating when the players are listening, so during some of the um, BG events, some players were listening. Uh, so it was just a oh, matter God. of uh, whether or not they wanted to um, take heed. Jim, you want to lower this to a race to four? 
because either uh, <sighs> we, we either 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 we can call the the right shots that maybe they, they don't see and they, and they go with what we say, or we we call the wrong shots and that could actually shark them. But you can see here, Jim and Nate are doing a good job sharking each other that we don't even have to do anything. Oh my God! If I don't run off from this, I'm gonna just put my cues away and leave. Are we still level? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Made What's four freaking balls on the table, and I'm still going to struggle to run off from here. What's the score? Four to four. Three, three. Yeah. Oh, four, four. Crazy. This is good pool. At least we're giving pe people plenty of time to get the donations in. So much yeah. so, we have uh, 54 people watching. Wow, can we miss up seven? Yeah, this is a fun bridge. All jokes aside, guys, who do you actually think who do you think is gonna win this, Chris? Oh, you know what? B based on what we're seeing right now, this is a, this is a pretty tough one to call. I'd have I'd have to say. Nicely done. Um, if I if I had to go just strictly on conditions that we're playing here, I would probably have to favor Nate in this one. You must hate money. <laughs> I mean, I donate to your events. So. Oh, look at the cue ball. Oh, yeah, red yeah, three. It's dry, though. It's a dry oh, it's break. dry. Anyway, oh. I think Jim should switch to the soft break. I might have to. I don't think my I don't think my neck's going to handle this for three sets. Yeah, go go free. I don't care. I'm going to continue cracking them, but that's because I don't have a soft break. I never practiced one. Well, I mean, I did, but not long enough to be able to switch to it comfortably. So let's see here. We got Sean Carpenter and Fred Dinsmore. Thank you so much for your donations. And Brienne Clemens. I hope I said that correctly. Thank you so much for your generous donation. I love everybody who donates. I love everybody who don't donate. But I still love the people who donate more. But I love Jim the mostest. He's my friend. It's okay. <laughs> ball, Mr. One Ball. Smashing Question break. is, will Jim do Nate tonight? What'd you say? Oh, oh, I see what you did there, Mark. <laughs> I didn't hear what you said, but I'm sure it's funny. <laughs> will, will Jim do Nate tonight? I hope so. To do his cat. <laughs> I'm not sure what to think of that, Jim. Oh my God, did I just scratch in the side pocket? No. But I sure hit it like a donkey. Good point, actually, Carly McGee. I have made pizzas bigger than that table that Nate's playing on you, right? <laughs> I feel like the commentators have to at least take neutral in the amount of like crap that they serve out. And uh, <laughs> if, you look at, if you look at the size of Nate, you'll guess who ate it as well. These are easily overcut. It's all right. I might make the six nice, ball. Nice hit on that one. Oh, I missed oh, it. Oh, wow. Good try, bud. I Did I undercut that? Oh, I can make that. I was thinking about the six as well a little bit there. Was you, Nate? No. I was right. selling out 100% for the three ball, but I don't think I could have. I don't think I could make it. I think uh, I think I got as much of it as I could have, and I undercut it. <clears throat> I should have probably took a look at it. That word does exist, actually, not a yes. We use it when we say the hostess with the mostess. So it does exist, yeah. Now that break looks familiar. <laughs> We've seen this one before. <laughs> you're, you're, two, you're two ball, though, still. I can't play position on anything. It goes to the yeah. left side, doesn't it? And into this bottom right, so. Yeah, played it well. No good. Want that to hold on. No good. Yeah, that's... Uh... Run it round to two rails, Jim. 
Nah, the table, the cloth is new. The eight ball should probably hold it enough to draw it. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Oh yeah, why don't you get in the way of the four ball, you little prick? That shot's not available on a on my table, but it's uh with a new cloth, it's available. Starting to get a bit painful, Paul. The shoulder? Yeah. Ibuprofen. I popped some. Wine. Red wine. Red wine. wine. Red wine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say, I, yeah, my shoulder's a little bit sore, too. I popped some ibuprofen from the from the from getting the, the shot. I popped some ibuprofen. It's feeling all right now. the longest there's ever going to be a silence for. I'm just enjoying watching that cue ball dance around the table right now. Pretty sexy, yeah? It is. I'm enjoying <laughs> watching Jim dance around the table. <laughs> sexy. sexy, cool. Going around like John Curry on ice. None of you know John Curry is your two years. Oh, 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 the seven God. ball again. Oh. That's the third time, Jim, that you've missed that seven ball in that same pocket. <laughs> just to remind him. Is it on me now? Am yes, I good? You're good. Seven balls in its customary spot. Marvelous break. What is uh is that the is that ball's the... a little bit nasty, but it's okay, I guess. The two's with the ten. Yeah. The four balls kind of crappy too. Oh, is that the four? Is it? I thought it was the eight. This is the four ball right here. Oh. Only because only because I got to go from the two to the four. Oh, I really want to be right there. So, Jim Ryan Harpson thinks that your next song should be "Red Red Wine." I'll drink to that. Hold on, stay right there, Jim. Stay right there. There you go, everybody. <laughs> All right. I can't scratch in the side pocket. If I do, I'm going to cry. Go, 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 go. Prost. Oh, slow down. Oh, jump count. Oh, no, it's the four, isn't it? That's no, the four. Was it no, a four or five combi or what? <sighs> I mean, I can cut the four into the side pocket. Play it's probably the four my off best the five. shot because. Four off the five. No. You probably, probably, probably make the eight. No, if, if I if I make it, the cue balls won't even hit the eight ball. Yeah, but then, but you won't, if you don't make it, then you might make the eight. Yeah, that's possible. But such a, I mean, that's such. That's the way people look at it. They they look at it and say, yeah, yeah, maybe I'll make the other ball if I make this one. Well, you don't need me the other ball if you make that one. <laughs> oh, five. Oh, five ball. No. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> in your face, Mendham. <laughs> That would have been a stinky four ball, anyways. Oh no, I wouldn't have. I couldn't make that. I would have, but I scratched. Man, yeah. these. This has got to be some yeah. more cool. Yeah, that's a little bit of a. That 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 helps a lot. Just get down result, there for the yeah. two, and you don't have to do anything for the five. Exactly. That's done him a big favour, dropping there, that three ball. I need some favours. As long as it's seven balls in the same spot, I got a chance. Is it? No, dang it. You're putting all your eggs in one basket on that seven ball that I keep missing. <laughs> 
Uh, you just read what I've just read. Yeah. From savage. Brian Bottich. <laughs> oh, it's savage. I mean, this is about as bad as Jim and I can both play. I don't, yeah. Shane I don't think we can play any worse than this. Shane versus Dennis would be over quicker than this one, I think. The 120. Come on, Jim, get a spurt on. Oh, the best, buddy. Is he frozen? Or is that just me? He's fine. No. Okay, never mind. He's lagging like crazy, unless it's just me. Nah, it's I, th I think it's just you, Nate. Okay. Just a move. It's okay. Just about perfect. Just for Joshua filler position. Jim is super serial right now. It looks like he's trying to find a comfortable position to. I'm trying to find a spot. I'm, I'm trying to still get my left eye over the cue without being in pain. Yeah. <laughs> well, if you spent more time drinking instead of uh, shooting, well, yeah. you wouldn't be feeling anything. Yeah, I'm, I'm working on it. Don't worry. Maybe if I could make more than two balls in a row off my break, huh? Good to see you enjoying it, Brian. We are as well. It's all in good fun, as you say. Oh, is Jim going to enjoy that? That it's works okay. out at least. I mean, well, it's tricky, but it, it goes. Is it a, a half ball hit, or maybe just just over a half ball hit to the side? Half ball, just yeah. under. Oh, you could you could just give me it, Nate, and say that's good, Jim. <laughs> all right, Jim, I'll give you it. You're good. Yeah, I can give you it. Yeah, very good, Paul. I'll take it. Sure, you can have it. I got it. I was gave. I gave it to you anyways. I'm at the table ready to break. Uh, I gave it to you, Jim. All right, I'll give you a scratch. All right, <laughs> you can have the scratch. Appreciate that. Here, let me uh, fulfill your wishes. Oh, I missed both wing balls. Three ball, uh -oh. three ball. Come on. Oh, eight ball. Yes. So he's just showing all the balls. Come on, one ball, two ball, three ball. Four, five, eight, 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 six, five, four, three, eight, seven. He sounded like a horse racing commentator there, Nate. <laughs> I'm just desperate, all right? I'm just desperate. They're just like numerical Tourette's coming out of his mouth. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Magic act, save me. Oh, now I can't even remove it. Dang it. Oh, I don't know what this is going to react like. I'm right on top of it. I might not get any backspin out of this. I think it's unmissable, isn't it? Uh, uh, you're going to blame the magic rack for your lack of cupola. No, I, no. I don't know. I don't know. Is that a thing? It. I don't know. Well, you put it there. True. No, it's fine. I'll get back on it again. Try again. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> That's not going to get anywhere close. Man, this is just like really disgusting pool, Jim. Which ball, are you, like, which ball are you on? I, I'm on the four ball, and oh, I had to play the four seven combination. And I changed my mind at the last second to go from inside to outside in English. And then I literally just hit it two diamonds. I mean, it's four, just really four seven combination. You mean the, the carom? Yeah, I was going to be playing it from up here and caroming the seven ball in. Oh, the four I mean, ball just, go. Double kiss no. the four ring. Oh, Double kiss the four. <laughs> That was terrible. I mean, it was that absolutely was atrocious. Yeah, it was garbage. Are you double kicking the four night? No, because the, the, the seven ball is going to come back and hit the four. I got a better chance of literally making the seven, the four, seven, four combination here. Well, what about if you just go straight into it and follow through and, and double hit the four in? That's what no, I just the said. No, the Three seven ball is going to, the seven ball is going right into the jaw. It's going to come back and hit the cue ball, the, oh, the okay. four ball right away. Oh, there you fucked in. Right. Yeah, pretty hard. <laughs> Oh my real gosh. first, re, re, real first four into the bottom right. Yeah, that's the shot. Unfortunately, that's so really. I mean, James, it's really just a poor shot. James Jack in the uh, Facebook chat wants to know if they have to make a ball on the break, and the answer is yes. They are following the same rules that they used for the VG10 events. You just have a to very, make a ball very break. stupid shot, Jim. Yeah, that that was pretty shit, really. I thought it's the four went straight in. No, it's. I mean, it's just. I mean, it's just really pitiful. 
And it's about a stupid, I mean, it's literally about the stupidest thing I've ever done in my entire life. <laughs> no, no, you agree. You agreed to do VG tens with me. Well, there's that. That's pretty stupid. <laughs> Man. That's a bad. Oh come on! Yes, a bit shy. I can't get I, I can't get myself ahead of him. What's the score? Like five five or something? Yep. Every time I get the chance to get ahead of him, I got a dry break or a scratch. I'm over here just prapping all over my own face. <laughs> James Jack says he loves watching Nate Miss. He's having great fun. I love watching Jack not breathe for five minutes at a time. Hey, I'm sorry. That's a, that's, I'm sorry, Jackie. That's a, that's a Scottish champion you're talking to. How many national titles have you won? I've lost a few. No. Oh, shit. Oh, that's another nice little tie-up you got there. Get on that two ball. <sighs> what a mess. Yeah, the rack doesn't look too great either, does it? <laughs> I think I might smoke one. <laughs> Actually, I would. Say, so what the hell? What do, you, what do you want to smoke for? You're going to be playing in about four seconds. I was going to say, I might not have much time. Is he going to move them or is he going to bank? Nate will try and bank it. He likes a bank. Stop, 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 stop. No, he's going he's gonna, to he's gonna hook himself. Ian, <laughs> Ian up, Stitchin just said he would love to watch three days of this gold. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not doing that. My shoulder won't last another three hours, mate. Kelly Kavanaugh. <laughs> Kelly Kavanaugh. All Kavanaugh, right, five in the side. Kelly Kavanaugh. Did he get the jump stick out again? Yeah. He did. I'm watching that seven ball. Oh, well, he didn't pull. Hope you didn't light up that cigarette, Jim. No, I'm ready. And this is just like, I can't. Oh, my God. I can't play a single position anymore. Oh, oh great. Great. Jubal. Jubal's okay. Don't knock it in three. He's okay. What is, it you, what is it you said to me, Nate, one time? It's like watching a drunk monkey trying to hump a football. <laughs> That's what it feels like, pal. <laughs> like, I can't control the cue ball for, like, if it was in my hand. <laughs> you need ball in hand with every shot, do you? No. I, I no. I don't think I'd pot the balls then. <laughs> and the grossest part about it is I'm like actually breaking the ball's pretty like okay. You're actually getting some pretty nice threads. That one wasn't one of them. But... Yeah. Oh. Actually, Kenny's asking, where are you playing, Nate? What what pool hall are you? The Rock Sports Bar and Grill in Sun Prairie, Wisconsin. I hope you heard that, Patrick, because I didn't understand what you said. The Rock Sports Bar and Grill. Ah, oh, The Rock. Okay. <sighs> Oh, they're coming off at funny angles. I need a beer, maybe. Yeah, go on, have a beer. Sounds like a plan. I think I might have another wine. Mmm, yummy. Yeah. Am I about to go in the lead? After, all this, this after all this absolute rubbish. If you make this 10. Yes. You take yes. the lead. Can I get a dogfish head? A dogfish head? I feel. I thought you said a doctor. Yeah, no. I'll come back and grab it. You'll need a doctor soon, I think. I you say, did, you, did you just have a baby sham? Yeah. Can I have a baby dogfish. sham? I'll have a baby sham. All right, here we go. I'm uh, back. Jim, Nate, or uh, James Jack in the uh, Facebook chat wants to know how the new rails playing. Uh, the fast, but I like them. They're consistent. Oh, I just broke fast. dry. But the I whole just broke dry now. Man, it's this is fast. just it's all falling apart. It's all going. The wheels are falling off. It's all going Pete Tong for oh, for fat it's... daddy. Now it's like really, really going to shit. Is it me again? Yes, it is. I think that's what it means. 
I'll give you so many. I give you so many chances, Nate. Thanks, Jim. That means I gave you so many chances too. Yeah, you just wouldn't take it. Watch out for that side pocket. Yeah, watch out for that side pocket. Got that break down now. And two's in the open. Three's in Thanks. the open. No problems. I smell blood. Yeah. Will he play the carom on the 10? What? Do you get any money for this? Oh, I know. This is just an exhibition. English there, just twisting it away from the two. Beautiful shot. Perfect angle on the three. Uh, I wasn't done. sure about that one because that's what I was worried about. Yeah, going forward. I didn't like going forward with the new rails. It's all right. I can get, I can get over here and out here somewhere. Maybe. Now the six <laughs> to the seven, the six to the seven is not super tough. So all you got to do is basically get onto it. Oh, oh a bit of a bobble. <clears throat> got a question for you, Jim, from MJ Toy. He says, "What's the exchange rate for Nate's Fargo? Is six six seven American? Hey, Mark, equivalent have to some respect. Fifty? Is it <laughs> equivalent to five? 50 in Scotland, he asks. <laughs> I think in Scotland, there's probably only about two people above a 550, to be honest. We're very, in Scotland, we're, we've got amazing players at different kind of Q, Q sports, but nine ball two isn't really one of them. Hmm. Oh, that's so bad. What is it, 6 5, yeah? Yes. Is uh, 10 ball last ball? Is it Nate on this? Yeah, you've got to respot the 10. Okay. I was going to say he's got a carom off the 310 if he needs to. Oh, has he got another rotten table? I really want to go outside for a smoke. Hurry up and run something, you Yeah, idiot. he's got a rotten table here. You pickle idiot. <laughs> well, he's in a pickle. He's gone all quiet. He must be unhappy. I don't even know where he's going to play the two. Is he going to side? No, he's having to do something funky with it, and it's uh, well, he likes leaving himself over the top of balls, doesn't he? Yeah, three this ten one's short. Yeah, he's got to play the three ten um, carom, I think. You're not playing the three ten carom. You're not playing the three ten carom. There's no freaking way I'm playing that three ten carom. All right, then come up with something different. Don't see well. So the, you could the, play three off the back. The three ball is going to go right back over to here. Best case scenario, and I'm spotting up the ten ball. There's going to be no shot on the eight ball and the ten ball. They're both going to block it. Unless it's I hit negative. it 400 miles an hour, then there's just no yeah, control. Yeah, draw line. I'm look. That's a negative. You're talking yourself out of it, Nate. If you get close enough to it, you can just play at pocket speed, and you'll get the three at the bottom left. As I'm looking at it. Mm -hmm. I like that. I like it as well. You just need to get close enough to it that you only need to give it a little tickle. Then you're good. You could even nudge into the eight off it and leave it into the side. No, that's not going to get you anywhere. No unless, unless these massive five-inch buckets will take it. I don't know. Maybe. It goes. They go off the first diamond. It goes. You cannot look. You cannot possibly look at that and say it goes. If that goes, I can hit it to right there. Yeah, we're going in. The problem is that your big fat ass is going to be in the way. Can we go to the side camera and see exactly where on the rail this hit? If this still drops, yeah, I'm, going this still I'm, going drop, to go, I'm going to go side camera on this and have a look, actually. Surely that's not going to still drop. No, I didn't think so. It bobbles. <laughs> You're in the wrong room. speed anyway. Well, I need to hold something on the floor ball. There was room for it still. Nah, I don't scan. Oh, it saved him. Give me a ball. Yeah. Saved and a lucky ball. I think the tide's turned and the luck is coming my way, Nate. 
If only I could run the table out, then you're in trouble. Right then. You can run one. <laughs> Ed Ladawi in the house. Hi, Ed. How are you doing, mate? Straight. Oh, he's got a little bit, not much. Yeah, you can see the way he hit that one. He wanted a little bit more of an angle so he didn't have to punch the cue ball as much to get to the five. Yeah, big stroke here now, Chris. <laughs> Took his eye off it, maybe. I don't know. Take my eye off of me. I can't go over the ball. Oh. Take my eye off it. <laughs> can't get my eye onto it. <laughs> I'd like to give a shout out to Neil Soloway. Thank you so much for your donation. <laughs> J-Dog Magfee over on YouTube wants to know if, if this is the finals for the 450 and under. This is the finals for the 450 and under. <laughs> is that what he said? Yeah. Yeah, tell him he's got the eight. <laughs> and the brakes. Oh, oh. going to be eight and the brakes, yeah. Nice stroke on that night. It was. He's starting to get the cue through now, isn't he? Oh, where's the cue ball? He's at? No, he's good. It pulls up really quick, doesn't it, that table? It's old cloth. So well over a year old. Needs to go when it hasn't. Have you hooked yourself, Cat Daddy? I have. Real first. Just bend real it first. round. Catch the no, rail real, first. Real first. Yeah. You bend it round, you're not going up to the nine. Yeah. I don't oh, too thin. Either. Too thin. Yeah, I thought he had to bend it slightly to get round that angle. But there you go. What do I know? Making that down. four regularly now, regularly, yeah. Oh. Could play it from there, look, if he, if he was in a, a, a normal game. Yeah. Put in my chalk. Then we'll see where I put my chalk. Oh. Was it right next to your wine? It was right next to my wine. I'll 
Così. Oh, this is going to test the shoulder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are right. Well, it's been a while, but it should be another one. <laughs> Closer to the first set. Oh, Jones. nice on the magic right. Nate, um, I ended up muting you, but I can't unmute you. So do you want to unmute yourself? No, I'll leave him as he is. Fucking hell, I'm not going to listen anyway. Yeah, a little bit noisy there, isn't it, Chris? There's all the people laughing at him. <laughs> Oh no! Am I ever going to get? To, am I ever going to get to smoke this cigarette? I think you'd have given again? up. You'd have given up by the end of this match, Jim. I think. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Is it me again? Is it? Yeah. Yes. What's the score? Uh, five to seven. You. Seven five. You lead. Oh, the breakout now, isn't it, Chris? Yep. No problems here this time. Three to the four, nice. Just two to the three is the shot, I guess, but not difficult. You stop the cue ball. Yeah, I don't. There's. I don't see anything difficult with the this layout here. No. I can make it difficult. Don't worry. <laughs> like that. Yeah, that was a bad shot. It takes a couple he, hours to get used to a new cloth. I know he thinks I'm over exaggerating and being dramatic, Jim, when I say this, but I, I honestly think. And I am going to say it again. I don't care what he thinks. But when he's in stroke, he's one of the nicest players to watch, honestly. He's just such a nice stroke on the ball. Thank you, mate. I appreciate that. That's what I was saying earlier. I was just, you know, watching the cue ball just dance around the table. Yeah, just it's like lovely and easy, isn't it? Easy on the eye, nice and smooth. Anyone watching, not a bad action to copy. Nice little pause on the backswing. Well, he's on the object ball and cue through. Head down. In it goes. Perfect pull. Pretty to watch. One away. He's on the hill. That puts him on the hill. Nate, do you want to unmute yourself? I didn't mute you that time. He doesn't want everybody to hear his tears. <laughs> Where's he going? Joel Thompson says, by the time you get used to your new cloth, it'll be old cloth. <laughs> yes, it is. Jim, you're up. Nobody's going to tell you, so I will. <laughs> What happened? Did you dry? Did you scratch? Hey! Yeah. Got kicked in the side again. Oh, oh I thought God. he picked it up. I thought he'd picked the cue ball up. Yeah, I did the throw it across the room. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. You've thrown it across the room a couple of times already with your jump shots, no? So, Jim on the hill then to go one set to nil up. Best of three sets. 
Oh, where's the cue ball? Oh, oh well, just don't oh. want to finish it. Well, Nate, Jim just returned the favor. Jim's still favourite, I think, for this uh, first set. Just wondering, Chris, you know, what Nate is, of course, playing on the smaller table, but there's less room to manoeuvre the cue ball around. What, what would you rather be playing on a ninth? Would you rather be playing on the nine foot or the seven foot? Chris is a man. Of course he'd want to play on the nine foot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 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 more of a nine foot. Uh, I prefer a nine foot uh, table uh, Ooh, to play on. Again. That looks Scratched like that was a again. dry break. Well, no, he, dry didn't, break. he didn't scratch. It was a dry break. Dry. But, yeah, I think he wants to get this set over and begin. Yeah, I want my smoke. Knows he can't win this one. I think. This is what we keep Mark around for. This expert commentary. I think Mark is yeah, still the favorite. Sure, that's not well. Oh, give me a two me. ball. Jeez. I'm only here because the three people you asked before me were all busy, I reckon. No, no, they weren't busy. They just didn't want to do it. <laughs> I'll watch anything, Jim. You know me. Yeah. I just don't have a clue what the speed of the table is in. Uh, Might be a little nudge into the eight here, though. Draw into the eight ball, leave himself on the three in the side. I think that's, Come the, on, ex Jim. I think that's the ten that's underneath Oh, is the it three. the ten, is it? Sorry. Okay. No, it's the black set, isn't it? I don't like those black sets. Trying to draw past the ten ball, maybe. Loads of right hand. Watch this off this back rail. Oh, nice Ooh, shot. How'd he hit it? Really bit into it, didn't he? Nice shot. Thank you, Notter. Get up there. Yes, just made it. Did I sound a little bit biased then? <laughs> just I want, this, I want this set over. <laughs> oh, he used all that pocket. Pocket speed. Kill the weight. Kill the weight, buddy. Kill the weight. Use all the pocket. You real. Back up towards the middle of the table. Yeah, below centre right. Well played. Yep, get underneath the angle. eight ball so he could use the side rail to get back to the nine. Textbook. Textbook. Wants a bounce off the rail. He's got it. Perfect. Across the face of the ten, Chris. And this looks absolutely perfect. Good rack and pull this. For the first set. Get up, you cat daddy. <laughs> <laughs> In it goes. So it is the first set to Jim Telfer. And how do you feel, Nate? Get your smoke in, Jim. <laughs> hey. You earned it. I'm going to go and take a... Any, uh, any, any plugs here before we uh, before we take a small break? Yeah, take a little take a little bit of time because I'm gonna go and ha I'm gonna have to go and take some sort of painkillers. Yeah. Yeah, it's a while. You wanna mention the uh, prizes that are up for grabs? Yeah, go for it, little Chris. You're you're in charge. Oh my goodness here. So if you'd like a chance to win a what is it, a thirteen hundred dollar Jacoby custom Q, uh, the uh, ways to donate are here in the pinned comments in Facebook and or actually they're not pinned on YouTube, but they are on YouTube. 
Um, I do believe the donations will be taken in up until the weekend because I think Nate's busy uh, throughout the week. But for the highest donator, and that's is that during the stream, Nate? Once the stream ends, that's when the highest donation uh, will end. Whenever we do the drawing, so. Oh, whenever so whenever we do yeah. the drawing, so whoever has the highest donation collectively uh, will also uh, win themselves a poison break queue. So it doesn't have to be a single donation; it can be a collection of donations. So if uh, if during today, for example, you donated fifty dollars, and then tomorrow you happen to donate another fifty dollars, you've donated a total of a hundred. And whoever has the highest total uh, by the time we do the raffle drawing for the Jacoby custom queue will be the winner of the poison break queue. And uh, during the break, I will try to scrounge up some pictures uh, so that way we can show what they look like. So stay tuned, everybody. We'll be right back. Donate, donate, donate. Share, share, share. Somebody's saying your volume's a little bit low, Chris, in this chat, a few people are saying it.
let's just let's just get going. Okay, and we are back. So we currently have the bagpipes up by one set, and he will start off the second one. So take it away, Jim. <laughs> Kicking your ass, cat daddy. Carly McGee's off. She's got to go and do some work. Thanks very much, Carly. See you again soon, I'm sure. Are we starting off That's with a dry break? Yeah. <laughs> we are. Okay, so there was a comment that my volume was a little low. Is it still low? Would, uh, would y'all be able to tell me? Let's try to. No, it's not. That's that's a negative. That's a, well, did you see the way that three ball flew in? Did make you about no, I'm, I'm not watching <laughs> anymore. I'm, I'm getting sick of watching all the luck you're getting. Yeah, that's fair. I can't have a cigarette this time, Jim. I think you say. It's like watching Germany. Oh, is that a perfect? Is that a perfect combination you've got there, Nate? Oh, that's yeah, that's why. Four or five. Oh, that, oh, that's that's unlucky, isn't it? <laughs> More more mourning than a house full of ghosts. Get it. Volume is much better, Chris. We're good. Oh, don't hook yourself. Don't man. hit the seven. There we mm. go. Seems to have quickened up a bit. Mine a bit loose. Yeah, because I, I didn't break dry. <laughs> <laughs> this is looking good here. Two rails. It would look better oh, if that big. It would look better if that big fat ass didn't keep getting in the way. Yeah, that's really. I mean, it's really just a poor shot. Again. Missed it by a fucking mile. Oh, he's, well, he's swearing. You potty mouth. Oh. Oh my god. Balls flying off the table. Q going Such anywhere. Potty mouth. You've got him, Jim. You've got him rattled. He needs some of Neil Spyan's mental coaching. I think he's been coached by I actually, I actually, I actually farted quite badly when I hit that break. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm not sure if that came through on the camera, but I farted really badly when I hit that. Didn't smell a thing. No, no I did. Stink <laughs> it smell, in here, it smells like deep heat and poo in here. <laughs> Oh, look at this sexy shooting. Sexy pool. Sexy pool. Time in the cue ball. Beautiful. Beautifully. Do we go funky or do we go normal? Go funky. Go funky. funky? Two rails All right, here. we go funky. Drawing two rails here. One. Oh, oh gosh, oh, how'd he oh, hit it? Oh, oh, oh. Go has, he, has he got an angle? Do we go funky again? Yeah, draw with <laughs> right. Draw with right. Watch this cue ball zip up. Oh, oh, oh you <laughs> I need. I did need to put a lot on it. To be fair. Yeah, he jumped up, Jim. I can keep down my shoulder. All right, come on, Nate. Well, he smashed that one. Five ball down. Five's gone. Had a decent spread, except for the four ball being on the side rail, but that shouldn't be that big of a deal. Okay, set 
sets up for the two in the side. I would have to make me think that the three is going in the top right, but is he underneath the two ball? Three rails, three rails to the three in the left center. Yeah. Two and, two and three in the same pocket, mate. I don't know that shot. You'd have, you'd have already called it if you were watching. Oh, I know, right? So why are you not playing it? Because I can hold the cue ball. Yeah, so the three goes in the uh, the top right. It's gonna have to get. It's gonna have to get. Un- it's gonna have to get underneath the four here. That was that was really stupid. I know. Yeah, if the four's on the left rail, yeah, you should really be playing stupid. the three into the center. You played completely the wrong shot there. I know. I know. Just draw it off the top rail and back in line. Try and miss the nine. Oh, he's caught the six. Uh huh. Jason Shaw, three say, rails. J- trick shot, bank shot. Jason, Jason Shaw, Jason Shaw. Is it going? Jason, Is it going? Jason Shaw. Oh, oh. oh, good try. This is this is really uh, this is making me want to just quit pool and just go back to like streaming. Well, you're not very good at streaming either. So. Welcome to my world, mate. <sighs> So in my own head at this point, I can't even uh, I can't even see shots. Well, I, if that if that was the case, I would just say, hey, just have fun with it, man. Exactly. Stop being such an idiot. Just fucking play. Hey, you yelled at me for having a potty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'm known for it. People think well, people think maybe. people think you're a clean living young man. People well, know I'm an asshole. <laughs> That's a stupid thing to think. Got to square them out right away. Ooh. Oh, nice little friendly That's tickle clean there. Living. <laughs> friendly tickle. I want no more out of you about rolls. I played that. I knew exactly what was happening there. Tom Koski says, go and have yourself a shot, mate. He'll pay for it. Go and get shot. Shit, I might need one. I'm actually going to go and have a few racks tomorrow in Clacton on Sea, Jim. Do you know where that is? Very nice. First time in five months. Hope you get nice weather. It's lovely down there if the weather's nice. Yeah. Ooh, nice high inside two rail. Yeah, perfect. Coming around for the nine in the top left. Oh. One more stroke. Yeah, it's actually, with, this is another with, slipper, with this with this slippery cloth, you could actually draw off the right cushion if you wanted to. So I'll do that then. Only because it's the slippery cloth. It'll slide for a while Woo. and then catch, yeah, just like that. Well, okay. We finally got something on the board. Oh, come on. It was the second rack. It's not like it took all day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Fair cat, Daddy. Get a match up. You're embarrassing yourself in front of all your fans. You, you, we managed to create some sort of celebrity status for you. You know, you're ruining it. I know. It's kind of sad, isn't it? <laughs> Just relax, Nate. Have some fun. Um, hold on, hold on. Nice shot. Lots of right hand English on that. Beautiful. Nate's a much better player when he just relaxes and just plays with ease and enjoys it. I disagree. I think Nate's a better player when he doesn't miss. <laughs> well, you're not missing when you're playing like that, are you? That's the whole point. So 
I'm just kidding. Miss under hit that one. Under hit that one big time. Oh, no, a bit of deceleration. Oh my play. goodness, that was great. <laughs> great night. That's the first point I made in two hours. You're up, Jim. Score is now one to one. Oh, and he started first, so we're actually on level terms. Jesus, Jim, you can't even beat me. <laughs> I sure already have, no? Oh, oh what a horrible oh. kick. Oh, oh, oh a dreadful kick. What wow. a pig of a game. What a pig of Unbelievable. <laughs> you better watch out, Jim. I'm getting I'm starting to find a gear. I might run another rack in an hour and a half. <laughs> then you're gonna be in some serious trouble. Yeah, I'm worried. I'm doing my best to keep you in this pal. Where's that cue ball going? We don't know. Into my hands. Yes. So only rude. three only three balls on the break this time. I know. Man, that's a, that's a great shot. Take the inside angle. Well, not that much inside, but yeah, it's a good shot. Maybe over and back twice. Yes. Oh, what a ball. Jeez, this how game's he, not that hard. How did he hit it? Wow. Friendly about tickle. As gross as you could possibly could. <laughs> oh, stabby draw. Looks like a double hit to me. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Nate. Come on, you're catching the gear here. Jim, is this good? I don't know, I'm not watching anymore. Oh. Nicely done. And with that, you take the lead. Oh, I'll give it up. Wow, three balls. Show off. Yeah, that's a beautiful Yeah, game. I can do it as well, huh? <laughs> <laughs> What a show! Is a seven ball at least in the in the bottom right corner, so I have a chance. Nope. Damn it. <laughs> I think this beer is coming to my rescue. James making short work of this rack. Perfect. Yeah. And Jim's not letting Nate get away from him. We are tied two to two. Get off the two ball. Get off the two ball. Oh, that's gross. Oh, that's gross. I like the sound of that. Oh, you should. It's really bad. Off the side route. No. Ooh, yeah, that is a bit stinky. Yeah, it's real bad. Doesn't go anywhere either. Wow. This is a tough way he's playing this. 
Yeah. No good. No good. Is he again, is it? Yeah. It's a bunch of it's a bunch of loud blustering idiots. But every single one of them can give me the three. <laughs> and I think the highest bar goes like four hundred and forty. You know, I just saw some new style senders flash up, Chris there. I didn't get to see them. Yeah, I'm gonna have to swap your pod. This one's about to run out. You can hear me, can you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, other than a non squatting call it. Oh, my eyes can't see that. Huh? <laughs> Oh, does it does it pass the eight? I don't know. I really I, I, honestly, can't see it. I, I honestly don't know. <laughs> I think we're all about to find out. No. Oh, well, a little bit of a know. clip there. What's the score? Two two. Two to two. Close match could go either way. Nine the side. Was that, was that the seven in the this corner? This is much better. That's a big ass. Have a salad. <laughs> I mean, come on, Nate. Jesus Christ, put down the fork. Oh, hold on. Put down uh, hold on, hold the on. Fork. There. All right. That's really disrespectful, Jim. All right. There. Yeah. We're, 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 we're good now. We're good. <laughs> It's very, very disrespectful. <laughs> oh, that was a lot of movement on that shot. I know, real Jim. Move. I know. Real smooth. Real smooth. He's feeling it. He's under the cosh. Ah, he's got this one. Perfect. This one's going to be a lot of movement, too. Drag it. Oh, no. Oh, I don't like rolling them. I prefer to drag it's all right. It. He played it with a buttload of effect, and he threw the weight. Yeah. No, I didn't. I rolled center ball and missed it. Yeah. Oh. Don't like rolling Even them. Even worse. Don't you like dragging them, no? Oh. If I like drag, if I like dragging, I would have dragged it. Ooh. 
<laughs> what a bitch. All right, let's see here while Jim gets himself settled in. You should be able to see on your screen now the two cues that are being given away. The top one is the Jacoby. Um, I think this is the Heritage 3. Uh, that'll be raffled off probably sometime this weekend. And then uh, along with the highest donator uh, will win the poison break cue that you see on the bottom there. What is he going to do with the three ball? Going to get funky. I think he can draw past it, he, leave okay, it into yeah, the same he, pocket. Can he get underneath it, it from here? Pocket. Or does he have uh, to two rail it? Yeah, two rail, twice across. Like that, beautiful. Don't hook over the seven. Perfect. Sexy pool. What a great shot. Oh, Ooh, nicely done here. Oh, I don't leave myself. Don't get ah. straight. That's what you don't want. No, I don't. I don't mind being straight. I just I can't play the shot Stretch. without hurting myself. Well, that was that was the, that was the whole point. <laughs> <laughs> if you're not straight, you don't have to stretch. <laughs> uh, this is gonna this is gonna hurt. Think I was not kicked in yet. Ah. Uh, How'd you do it, Jim? What? The shoulder. Uh, it slept badly. Oh. Uh, and then it uh, must have slept strange. And then I felt a twinge in my neck one day. I was just moving around. I was doing nothing. And I felt a twinge and I thought, uh oh, that's one of those. I've had it loads of times before. And then I played a set of Ghost Pool in a tournament on Saturday. And I played a jump shot and the whole thing just went snap. Oh. And. Uh, yeah, I felt it go, and the whole <laughs> body started twitching. Mm. So I had to stop playing. Uh, Quick shout out to the uh, the uh, the viewers on YouTube. Thanks for being here. Oh, he's in stroke now. I'm all right as long as I'm on my feet and not leaning on the table. Needs another one here. Nice long stroke. Oh, how well has he hit that? Too well. Too well. Too well. Oh, my goodness. Bank it, maybe. I was going to say, is that is a dead bank? I like cutting this. Yeah, I don't know about these cushions for the bank. I haven't played yeah. a bank shot on these new cushions yet. I'll go for a cut. Nice. Oh, he oh, undercut it. I thought it was there. Honestly, thought it was there. I like how uh, Nate's microphone cut in right as he was stroking. Yeah, I was just going to say <laughs> the same thing, Chris. He's a horrible human being. <laughs> I think he's scratched, though. Oh, no. Straight back to you, Jim. Oh, God, give me a chance. <laughs> All right, well, then, while uh, Jim is getting ready. What's the score, anyway? Is it still 2-2? Two -two? It's still 2-2. Two two. God, we suck at this. Here's another look at the Jacoby custom queue and the Get yourself a Jacoby. poison Jac break queue. Get yourself a Jacoby. I've got one that's beautiful. <laughs> Hit that badly. Hit that real bad. Right, Nate, you can have another go. <laughs> it's a try break. <laughs> I'm on it. Hold my beer. Take it away, Nate. Watch out, oh, Nate. Hurry pocket. up. I need it. 
Hurry up and make some balls. I need a rest. Nine in the side. Cue ball's getting kicked around again. There goes the five. Oh, that goes. The, oh, that's so uh, ugly. The one doesn't stay up, or the one stays up. The two oh, and the ten, Oh, this is so though. easy. This is so easy if that one ball falls. Yep. Uh, oh, he only made three balls. Oh, you shame. No, he made four. Right? Oh, he's made four uh, balls and he's moaning so about easy. it. It's <laughs> so uh, Yeah, this rack is just so easy if that stupid one ball falls. Listen, every ten ball rack's easy if you make five balls on the break, mate. That's true. <laughs> Can't argue with that logic. That's a good shot. That's a uh, really good shot. I mean, you'd expect it from an 863 Fargo, but yeah, still a good shot. Well, this might have to go. This might have to travel a little bit. Oh, I like the way he played that because that's how I would have done it. Yeah, you can do that on a seven foot table. <laughs> Set up for the side pocket, maybe, or nice no, he played it for the side. Mm. I played it for the side, but in hindsight, it was just really stupid. It wasn't a good choice, no. No, I was stupid. I mean, I'm really just, I'm, I'm just not thinking right now. I mean, my mind is just bleh, no confidence. But I'm gonna make this shot. But you don't, dollar. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you froze up. It was just a oh, long, I did well. it was oh, a a long pause backstroke. <laughs> Dollar? Dollar. Oh, I, honestly, oh, I, no. I honestly thought about uh, trying to take the other side of it and dogging it on purpose and just winning a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> just trying to get, try get something out of this match. <laughs> Oh, it's going to scratch. Uh-oh. No. Might be dry, though. Oh. Nope, it's not dry. The infamous seven ball is gone. The bane of my night. Yeah. Closest thing I have to a chance is gone. It's so loud in here. That was less than good. Oh, are you kidding me? Look at that for a bone. Is, are you hooked? I think you can just I, turn I, it round. Bit of right-hand English, maybe. So I could tell. I could tell off of your shot that that was a. Uh, normally I would jump. The, normally I'd no, jump that was. I don't think I can. <clears throat> that was um, and that had nothing to do with the bounce. I could tell that was going to be there from the way you shot it. No, it seemed to straighten up off this rail. It came from here. It should have gone to here. Yeah. Still on that a little bit. Yeah. Oh, how'd he hit it? That was a good shot. Beautiful. Good little touch. Those ones you just can't hit too hard, can you? You hit it perfect pace to allow the, the side to twist it round. Beautiful. Hmm. So, Jim, uh, Tom Kasha says that if you do lose, you got to drive that sweet pink car around. <laughs> That's a celebration dance. <laughs> Like well, that's what I was just going to ask. Do you just roll this in for the four in the right middle? No, I draw it into the side rail. Yeah, I was going to say, I think the draw is a better option. Although on the slidey cloth, it might uh, it might not catch it quick enough. You might you end up scratching. Shut up while I'm playing. <laughs> yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Sick. So who you, fan who you fancy in for the Masters then, guys? Alden. Eklenty. Chris? I probably would have to say Albin. Oh, I haven't even racked the ball. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to give Jim a little bit more of a break. when I uh, I knew I was going to break dry on this one, so I wanted to take a little extra time to rack I'm him so he has a little break. I'm going Fedor just for the record. 
I mean, there's about six or, like seven, such a brutal draw. There's six or seven guys that you wouldn't be surprised if they won. I think I, I personally think it'll be somebody who's already performed well on the matchroom tables. I don't think it'll be any big surprises. I think it'll be a Moscone Cup player or somebody who's you know done a matchroom event like a like a Al Qaeda or something. Like that. I think I think Kelly's going to win. Who do you fancy, Jim, out of um, Sky and Billy? It's quite a good, interesting first prelim, isn't it? Um, I fancy Billy, Sky. to be honest. I think Billy wins that. Well, Nate seemed to have uh, found something there with the break. Sky should win it, but I think Billy will be more motivated. I thought Billy was the better out of the two in the World Cup of Pool as well when they were here. I didn't actually well, I didn't actually see that match, so I really couldn't tell. Yeah, Sky was a little bit more par than that, to be honest. I think I mean, I, I think Billy's probably played more than Sky has in the last uh, month. Right. Telephone night. Oh, I was at the. I can hear something ringing in the background. It's the ball bangers not having any idea how to use the phone. <laughs> What's the score? Uh, the score is fixing to be 4 2. Oh, is this going to be. Oh, fuck me. Best get my skates on. Do you need help? Should I dog this? No, you're all right. You'll, you'll dog one at some stage anyway. Might, yeah. Doesn't have to be now. That's true. <laughs> He's got a point there, you know. Nicely done. Where's, okay, there we go. Goodness gracious, Nate. <laughs> how what do I do? Is, how much is an hour there to play, Nate? It's going to cost you a fortune in table hire. Um, when, hey, listen. When you're almost as important as me, Nate's a celebrity over there. Nate, you pay Nate's double. A celebrity. You pay double the table time. So I'm paying <laughs> 55 an hour. <laughs> Nate is a celebrity in that room. They pay him. They pay him to come and play. To be honest, I don't think there's a single person in this entire room that likes me, Jim. Well, there's not one in this room either. <laughs> oh, savage. That's, just, that's only because your daughter's not in there. She loves <laughs> oh. me. We're friends. She actually thinks you're quite cool. She thinks she thinks you're amusing. I'm not sure if that means she likes you or if you're just like sort of a clown to her. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> that kind of counts for our relationship too, doesn't it, buddy? I was going to say, you, you'll take any sort of positive <laughs> comment, really, won't you? you don't know. Oh, so I'll be the clown. It's all right. All right. So we can see it looks like Jim's trying to draw back here for the two to go into the right middle. No, That's no, pretty good. No big deal here to get to the three. The well, it could four, be. I think the, the I, four, though. I think you got to draw the cue. I think you got to draw the white ball off the bottom round, play short side in the three, so you can move the seven ball. Did anybody decided, believe any of that? I decided that <laughs> play, play, play the four off the back of it, maybe. Not, beating you is not innocent anymore. So I'm just going to start playing some funky shots. Uh, you could... make, make the most of the table that I've got. Yeah, he's gonna. Is he going to go around the back of the ten here? I. I don't know. I would think not. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's what I thought. Is it going to get there, don't though? Hit it. Or hit it. Hit it full up. Oh. Karim on the seven, maybe. Combo on the seven. Undercut it slightly. Well played. Hold the cue ball. Oh, yeah. Got to bank this now. Oh, yeah, now you got to bank. <laughs> You're on about bank. Silly. You boys are silly. Oh, is there room this between is the them? same thing. You're coming off the rail. So it's a kick. A bank. This, is a, this is a kick, not a bank. This is the first time in the commentary. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it is, Flo Pigeon. Coffee table. Look at that. You mm -hmm. baked it short. Did, isn't that what uh, Pigeon said to you the first time that uh, you, he was ever on com The first and only time, I should say, he was on commentary with us? <laughs> you, you upset you, didn't you? Well, Who's yeah, I disrespected the heck out of Chris. Who's that? Oh, um, 
Chris Patient, Pigeon. Chris Pigeon, yeah. Pigeon Paul, yeah. It's, Br- it's British humour. He didn't mean anything by it. Nah. So shit. Did you scratch? Yeah. Oh. oh. Did he scratch? He scratched. Yeah. All right, Nate. I'm getting out of this rack. One dollar. Yeah, but I'll I'll, uh, I'll double it on over or under one and a half, and you can you can pick. No, I don't trust my break. All right, no, yeah, okay. I'll t- double it under. I'll take the under. Help you break dry. Well, they were quits, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sounds like a lot of balls falling. Oh, I was right. going to say, it sounds like a lot of balls falling. I mean, good. two balls. Just, so I'm playing for nothing now. <laughs> well, no, you're playing to save your butt. I'm playing to save a dollar. And what are we at now? Uh, what is that? One uh, dollar only? Oh, well, after all those bets we made during the BG. <laughs> at one point in time, I think I was down $70. <laughs> yeah, you were down quite a bit at one stage. I think I was down like 22 at the highest. Yeah, yeah, I think the highest I ever was up was like $2. Yeah. I like how you take the under just like, well, I'm only going to make one ball. <laughs> well, yeah, I've been making either one or zero the entire night. <laughs> I'm only going to make one ball. <laughs> You only need one to get in the rack. Yeah, you hit that one, okay. Okay, how, how many times are you going to draw the ball for position? No, uh, well, one more at least. I'm going to say, <laughs> I'm going to say at least two more, probably. At least two more. I don't think I can draw off the eight. Well, I could draw off the eight from here. Yeah. <laughs> a real player would touch nine rails before he finished this rack. Oh, it's going to be tough to draw from there. Are you on about? Oh, maybe not. Too bad that wasn't the seven ball. You'd have dogged it. <laughs> My dog is ten. Oh, no, I didn't. I'm not lucky. at this rate. Not at this rate. Nicely done, Jim. Check this out. I'm going to scratch again. Take that. At least give me time to write the ball. What's the score? 4-3? Four, 4-3? Three. Four, three. Four to 3-3. Three. 4-3. to three. Nine ball down. I just saw the cue ball get kicked. Where is it going? A bunch of times. That's a tight window for the two ball. Yeah. Try to get in between gotta, the four and the seven. All I got to do is get onto it, though. I suppose it's the three ball where it's at. <laughs> Some one time off the short rail and trying to land in the window. Is it going to get there? Did you get there? Perfect. Perfect. I don't know. You guys tell me. Did I yeah. get there? I think you got there. I think you got there. Yes. <laughs> How many idiots have we got watching this? Tell you what, we got Carl Boutte just joined us, the pickle man. He's hey, the pickle. Well, the pickle yeah, the casino ran uh, apparently the casino ran out of money, so he decided he's gonna come hang out with us now. Mr. Pickles in the house. We've got 39 at the moment, Jim. Donate, donate, donate. Share, for a good share, cause. Share. For a good cause, get people to Vegas and you can win your dirt well to London for the Moscone Cup and you can get yourself a fifteen hundred dollar Jacoby. Highest Highest donation for the entire event, for the high, entire day, automatically wins a jump cue, or a break cue, sorry, from Poison. And the draw will be made for every $5 donation, gets you one ticket in the raffle for a $1,300 Jacoby. Not bad. And they actually, they actually sent me one very recently. I'll let you see it. Show us, Jim. Look at this. So not good it's going to show up on my camera. Just a second, let Nate finish his rack first, and I'll let you, let everybody see. Yeah. I hooked myself on the time. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Stop, well, stop. Done. There you go. Okay. I thought I almost, I thought I was going to. Very nice. Did Jim get out of that last rack? Did we break even? Yeah, we broke even. Bummer. 
There you go, Nate, holding on to the lead. Okay, Jim, let's see the let's see the cue. Wow, that is, that is a gorgeous cue. The elephant. You must hate money. So I'm gonna give that to you. Beautiful. All custom made to your liking, right? Yeah, Found. pretty sweet, huh? Pretty sweet. Thank you very much. Jacoby custom cues. Jacoby custom and you can win yourself. You can win yourself a Jacoby cue just by donating to this stupid match. And if you want to just get yourself, <laughs> it's not going to be. Wanna... It, it's not going to be as nice as my cue, but it's still going to be a good Jacoby. And, the, and Jacobi if you just want to get yourself one, let me know. I can yeah. hook you up with one. And I the can Jacobi cue get... that uh, Jim is talking about is the top one here, and the poison break cue is over here on the bottom. Sorry, Nate. <laughs> And if anybody just wants a Jacoby custom cue because the, they think they're beautiful, let me know and I can hook you up with a deal on one. And also, I want to give a shout out to Serge Das, Serge Das Billiard, to put on put new brand new rails on my table and a brand new cloth. Why don't you break the balls, you clown? Shut up. I'm doing, I'm, oh, I'm sorry. doing my bit here. <laughs> Thank you very much, Serge. Serge Das Billiard, get in touch with them if you're anywhere in this area, in Netherlands, Belgium, Germany. He's the best in the business for fitting your table. He might like to dog a shot clock and a ball in hand one ball at the World Cup of Pool, but he does know how to fit a table. So, so Jim, Jim, is there anybody in the Netherlands that can uh, make you shoot a little faster? Shut up, you tug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I'm just looking at the scoreboard for the first time now. You literally have bagpipes and cat daddy. <laughs> I told you I was going to. Oh, geez. I figured you'd change it after like two minutes. Uh, what are we at, Jim? Uh, we at uh, $2 again? You think I'm getting out of this or not? Uh, I mean, I do. 100%. <laughs> I was like, it's like, I really, I, I do actually shit. <laughs> do, yeah. I'll take a bet just for funsies. All right, then. Let's do it. Yeah, top right. Draw down. Oh, I've got the, I don't want to play with that cue. Hey, Jim, can you do me a favor and call the, the bar that I'm at and uh, order me another beer to my table? No. All right. Well, I am? I'm not you, bitch. I mean, you kind of are, aren't you? I mean, literally. I mean, let's let's talk real for a second. I mean, you kind of are, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I, I do actually do all this for free. Yeah, yeah. Let's, so, yeah, let's, yeah. Real, yeah, let's take a second and really think about that statement, Jim. I mean, because yeah. you, you kind of are, aren't you? I kind of am, yeah. Really in it. Of all the people whose bitch I could have been, Jesus, to be you. Worst, you're the Robin to the worst Batman in history. I am the, the Robin most to the incompetent, world. pathetic, yep. ugly, fat, gravy, vein filled Golly. Batman. <laughs> yep, basically. <laughs> oh, this is a tough shot. You, it's very common to overcut this. That would be a really good entrance walk-on description of you, actually, Nate, what you just said. And here <laughs> he is, that, all the way from kid. Wisconsin, the gravy vein filled, <laughs> overweight. Oh, <laughs> 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 finally! Jim, <laughs> Jim finally stands up with a shout from laughter. My favorite part about this is there's people that literally in the bar that have no clue what's happening right now. They just keep looking over at me laughing and like, what the hell is wrong with that guy? <laughs> is he special? They're probably like, once he's done laughing, I'm going to ask if they want the six. <laughs> That's like the third time I've overdrawn that shot from the seven to eight. Very hard on yourself, Jim. But not oh, quite too which much. pocket? Which pocket? Uh, just do it easy. Probably, it was Do it easy. Up. Probably the one in the corner. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Do it the easy way. Center ball, you got a chance at scratching. Have you ever played this game before? No, not really. You certainly would never know by watching me play. <laughs> that was the comment I got from Pigeon. <laughs> you played this game before? <laughs> All right, with that, that puts us within one what? game. Oh, that's really cool. And he said that you, it's Brad, I think. He said that he, he wants me to put that on your tab with the money that you will. 
Oh, Kai. Oh my God. That's, that's so, that's so fantastic. Somebody from Vegas just called the, the bar that I'm at and ordered me a drink and they brought it over. So that's kind of fun. Nice. Somebody from where? From Vegas. I'm assuming it's Kyle Boutte. <laughs> cool. But uh, the bartender just came over. She's like, somebody ordered you this beer from Vegas. And <laughs> it, is, it is Kyle Boutte. He's just put a message on, enjoy the beer, Nate Minden. How that cool makes me that? so happy. And could, uh, if, 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 I give you the, if I give you the phone number of my wife, can you call her and tell me to bring me another bottle? Don't worry, Jim. I already have, the, I already have the, the phone number of your wife. Don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's got you blocked. Oh come on, Kai! Uh, that was so much. More, that was so much more funny than that. Somebody give me a little bit. Really? Are you, are, you, are, you, are you begging for laughs? I am. I honestly thought that was funny, Jim. I really feel like that was funnier than I'm getting credit for. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm, I nearly made that joke, but I'm scared of Jim, so I didn't. I might bump into him one day, so I refrained from. No, nah, Mark. You, well, you, you clearly be, have never you, bumped you, into you, him you, before. You'd never be. You wouldn't be afraid of him. The dude weighs <laughs> six pounds. I was actually going to say, Jim, everyone has Gumby. got her number, is what I was going to say, but I would never say that. You know that, Jim, right? No, uh, but at the end of the day, you can say what you want, but if I come running at you at the Moscone Cup, you are going to turn and you are going to let, get away from me. Yeah. Stop it. You will not get involved. <laughs> you stop it. Have you two actually met in person? You two? No. Yeah, he was, he, the, first time I met, the first time I met Nate, Nate I was asking I people. I just scratched. Who, what an idiot. Just scratched. Just kidding. No, you haven't. I was actually asking people, other Americans uh, in the in the pool hall were in, who is that irritating asshole that won't <laughs> leave me alone? Because I'd organized the Moscone Cup fans match. Jim, what should I do with the shot? What have you got to get to? Well, I got to get. Well, I got the five, but the six ball doesn't go anywhere. Where's your five? Is that the one in the middle of the table? Yeah. Leave yourself a Cameron. Yeah, you got to get you just just get yourself on the five. Yeah, combination. No, get yourself on the five into the in, in past the nine and the eight or seven or whatever it is. It doesn't matter what angle you're on. You're going to either be able to come via the rail or straight into the nine and the six. Mm -hmm. okay. Just put, make sure you're playing for the five into that pocket and you should be all right anyway. Oh, I almost forgot something. Let's see if I can do this. I hit it, hit it so hard. Yeah, that well, because I don't know how to play this game. But you, you've actually come not too bad. Now you can draw it in as a rail. Well, I can actually go. I can actually back cut it still and run it two rails into them, or I could go into the top right and run into them. Or off the way. side, round right into them. So I think, I, I think the, the better way the, is actually uh, by the seven still. Doing this. Off the off the no off the side rail in between the seven and the nine and play the six into the top left. Don't even don't even touch anything. Yeah, no, I got too much angle for that. Oh, you don't. No. Straighten it. Oh, out. you're oh you're talking in between these two rails. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. So I think Jim just I you talked about doing rails. this. You guys can't Definitely see what the, you guys can't see what okay. I'm doing, but I'm actually trying to draw uh, for the viewers uh, what y'all are talking about. I bet that's going well. <laughs> I How'd I do? Doing. Cool. Like, it looks like, like a champ. Away. Like a champ. It just looks like Nate's stream anyway, because it's you just made made seven, blurs. Yeah. Oh hit. well. I got a good hit. hit. Seven. Told you, yeah, that was a good hit. Come on, <laughs> Jim. <laughs> Come on, Jim. Finish that up. That was a good hit. Now I made the nine ball. Is it still me? I guess it's my shot no. now, is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's your shot, Jim. Oh. Oh, the side balls didn't go. Uh, I don't hear looks anything. like we got a ball go in the corner. Oh, that's bullshit. <laughs> Jim, why don't you break dry anymore? I'm trying. Trust me, I am. So it oh. looks like the question is going to be, Jim, is how are you going to get to the three ball? Very carefully. That's kind of the question I'm asking myself as well. Once leaving himself half ball, doesn't Not he? And then you. into this yeah. bottom left and right? then draw so up you with the side right. Roll the roll the one ball in and allow the cue yeah. ball to roll forward to about where your cue is. And that way you yeah. can shoot the two here into the in bottom the nine left and, six. and then come in between the nine and the six like this. He's just using his thing again. He's, he's using his new toy. He's using his new toy. <laughs> that looks about right. Might be a little bit straight, but I think he can force it. Over. Hey, Chris, do your job to plug the raffles. Well, 
Nine, Get your donations eight, in, nine. folks, because for every $5 donation gets you a ticket into the raffle for the Jacoby Custom Q that you now see on your screen, so that way we don't see Jim miss. Uh, the top here is, I think, is the Jacoby hey, Heritage 3, cheeky, <laughs> while the bottom queue is a Poison Break queue that is going to go to the highest donator when we raffle off the Jacoby Custom Q. All the ways to donate are in the pinned comment here on Facebook, and I believe it's the top comment on YouTube. And where is the – that almost scratched. And where does all the money go to? Oh, and all the money is going to helping uh, us raise uh, what, what to cover the cost it's going to take for – are we taking 40? Is that the number so far? Shot yeah. Jim. Well, yeah, we have 40 tickets set aside. There's for nobody watching Cup. these shots I'm playing. God. I said Damn shot, me. Jim. You people. Shut up, Jim. We're talking about, <laughs> we're talking about raising it. money. Call yourself pundit. All of the money that we are raising for this event is going towards buying tickets to the Moscone Cup. So anybody who wants to be in our... There goes the shoulder. Yep. Our... Oh, my headset's dying. That's really unfortunate because I don't have another one with me. Go yes, boy, all, all the money is being raised to help uh, pay for the uh, the tickets to get, uh, so far, 40 people to London for the uh, Moscone Cup this year. And you can be one of them. Anybody that wants to go can be part of that. And... As long as you donate at least five dollars to the stream today, you will get discounted tickets or potentially free tickets to the Moscone Cup as long as you're part of our group. So you have to buy me a beer when you're there. And me. Sarah Jane's asking uh, what dates it is. I believe it's the sixth of December to the ninth. Uh, so I, I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to go charge my headset for about ten minutes. So I, um, I'm going to go do that right now. Mm-hmm. So you won't be able to reach me for a little while. Okay. The venue is yet to be decided. I know Jim doesn't like the Alexandra Palace. Well, I've got a, I've got a feeling it's going to be Coventry, the Rico Centre. If I'm, it'll be there. will be Coventry. It'll be Milton Keynes. Yeah, yeah, one of the two. So well, Jim, you done uh, you done tied it all up with that one. Are we level? Are we? Yeah, oh five God. to five. Come on, Jim, knock this one out. Do what? <laughs> knock one out? <laughs> <laughs> no, knock this one out. <laughs> oh, my God. It's not, not true what people stream. say about me, Jim. No, I'm not doing that on live stream. Oh, oh no. Is, is that dry? a dry break or did he it's scratch? dry break. I got to go again. Yep, you're back up, Jim. Crap, it's hard work, this. I gotta say that table looks as if it's playing beautiful now, Jim. It's playing nice. I just, I'm just, I, mean, I could have done with maybe just an hour on it before we get started. Four ball down. Needs a bit of a scatter. Got it. He's got on it. Yeah. Look at this. Another nice layout here. No problems whatsoever. Yeah, no really, uh, no real big movements here. Stop shot on the two for the three and the five to go into the same corner. Yeah. Get that magic rack out of the way. Oops. Oh, oh, that's a foul. No one saw that. <laughs> that's a foul. Jeez. Jim. Yeah, lazy. Well, Nate can't hear us, and I don't know if he's watching. Carl Boutet, can you call him and tell him? There we go. Nope, there we go. Call the bar, call the bar, Kyle. Get him to play. <laughs> You've got the number. That's a mixture of, of being a bit de- dizzy from painkillers. Oh, what's being happening a bit, there? He must have been a bit he, lazy. He must have scratched. He must have saw that he was going to scratch because he, he blocks the, the bottom left corner pocket yeah. on that one. So, Jim, you're back up. He potted oh, three balls as well off that break. It was a huge break. But unfortunately, one uh, he potted the white as well. I'll tell you what, a little bit of advice for people out there. white, Red wine and painkillers. What a combination. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm fly- I am flying. <laughs> <laughs> that is brilliant. I'm having a great time here. Well, if you, really wanna, if, you, if you really want to fly, you should add some Red Bull to that mix then, huh? Oh, God, no. <laughs> Never get to sleep. Can we just tell you, please, that we do not condone the use of drugs? And alcohol in the same. It's not. Hey, I've got nothing wrong with alcohol. This is, this is my <laughs> tournament. <laughs> oh, but, uh, but Jim, what, what are you going to do with the eight ball? No idea. 
Yeah, I'll just be happy if I get that far. <laughs> and hopefully, I would like to be able to have some sort of angle that I can just give it a little nudge playing the two. Yeah, okay. It'd be nice. But if I don't, then I'll figure something out later on. I think I've hit that too hard. Too so hard, don't, yeah. Way I'm gonna too hard. Now. Yeah. Get the magic wreck out of the way completely this time, Jim. With your hand. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, guys. <laughs> I'm just going to... I'm just going to wait and play something funky on the <clears throat> on the heat. So this looks like this goes to the side rail and back out towards the middle. You're probably just going to have to take the combination and just respot it, huh? I think yeah, you can yeah. just play yeah. on it. Very yeah. Yeah. Are you going to try to get it there? So yeah. let's try and get it there. What are we talking about? We're going to play the four or something like this, or are we, that's the five and what? Get the cue ball to come out like this. Oh, you drew it over here, so never mind. So now we're looking at something like this, to where you hopefully get the cue ball to do this. And if I over, if I overrun, I could have it there. If I overrun further, I could have it there. I might. I'll probably actually get nowhere near it. But I want to get here. Yep. Oh God! Oh, oh you hit that! Thick. You hit that beautifully. So thick. So <laughs> thick. <laughs> so thick. How about we just go for the combi? Oh, oh where's risk. where's the cue ball? Oh, where's the yeah. eight ball? Oh, perfect. Middle pocket for the ten. That's a result. <laughs> what a result is that there? Wow. Sexy pool. Don't dog it now, Telfer. Nicely yes. done. Yeah, and with well, that rack, you take the lead. Uh, to answer your cat question, Daddy. Cody, you like cat Daddy? can't really answer that question until they decide on the venue because Birmingham could be the best airport. What do you reckon, Jim? You're the expert on airports. Well, what's that for? For the Moscone. I know we don't exactly know where it is, but what about the two alternatives? Maybe Milton Keynes, I guess, would be what? Stansted? Well, yeah, Milton Keynes, you can take any of the London airports, really. But but you want to take what, like uh, Heathrow or Stansted? If it's going to be in Coventry, then Birmingham's a good one. Yeah. So there you go. Choice of two. But until they announce it, uh, yeah. obviously, you don't want to be booking any tickets. But if you're coming from the States, if you're, if anyone's coming from the States, they're going to go into Heathrow anyway. They've got no real choice other than that, I don't think. Maybe they, come, maybe they can get into Gatwick, but I don't think it really matters once you're in London. No. Once you're in London, you just get to the centre of London and get uh get one of the trains will take you up that area, no problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is Nate into his rack? Is he? Got about meanwhile, meanwhile, Nate is flying. Slide this past the. He's making seven. good work of his rack. Don't get hooked behind the eight, though. Oh, he has again. Ah, oh, he didn't. Ball. I don't think he landed in the window. No, he's going to have to kick this off the side. He'll, rail, he'll jump it. He'll Watch jump. That white ball's going underneath. Cue ball's going to go there. over the other side of the. Might as well get a drink while you're retrieving the cue ball there, Nate. Oh, oh how would he hit it? Where's the cue ball going? Where's no, the cue ball? Don't go in. Don't go in. Don't go in. I really don't want to, as no, much as I. What a great shot! Wow. As much as I like taking the piss, you don't deserve to. You don't deserve <laughs> to scratch when you play a shot like that. Shot of the day so far. Can't, Daddy. Not bad, my man. He does. Even, when, he doesn't when, even... you, when your positional when your positional play is so bad, you find out that you you end up finding out that you're quite good at jumping. <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't even get to hear all the excitement. He has to I watch know. it on the replay. <laughs> He'll be gutted now because he can't hear it. He'll be thinking to himself, "God, I might have played a fantastic shot, and I can't hear it. Has he done himself oh, again?" More deceleration. No, he's fine. Gonna, he's the seven balls down up. here. He I was going to ask him actually, Jim, what advice he gave to Kelly. Do you know? For the jumping, no idea. Probably just play, play when you're practicing, play ship position, and then <laughs> oh my God, uh, then jump. Yeah. Did he hit enough of it? Yeah, he he's good right, there. Yeah. Don't dog it now, dickhead. <laughs> What's the score anyway? If he runs this out, it's going to be tied. He's not getting out. He's why has he not played it in the top corner? Why did he come up there? I figured he overhit that. I'd, I'd be playing that in the bottom right. Oh, oh dear, oh, dear. 
Not bad bank. Yeah. Six five, right? No, this is gonna be six six. Wow. Oh, uh, that's Look it. See, that. now he can't, now, now he can't hear what we're saying. He's concentrated. <sighs> All right then. Put the pressure on him again. From one oh. jump shot to one tight bank shot, we are tied six to six. I'm not gonna get a ball uh -oh. here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, seven, seven ball. ball. Whoa! Look at the five. Five in the side. I made a couple, yeah. Oh, two balls, yeah. Should do a bit of speed pull. This mate doesn't like that. I'm apparently a very slow player. I might be very speedy. I might not get out here. Come past it. Uh oh. Oh, uh, don't scratch. Oh, <laughs> too much for speed pull. <laughs> oh, so slippy, so slidey. I wonder if Nate went to go get his. Uh, there he is. Uh, Are you back? Is it my? Yeah, is it my turn? Yes, it's your turn. You missed yeah. all the excitement uh, that you gave us when you hit that jump shot. I missed what? When you, all, you heard, you missed all the excitement we got uh, when you hit that jump shot. On the yeah, flagpole. Played that pattern well, didn't I? Not many Good people shot, play it that way. Good jump shot, Fatty. Thanks. Got well, a scratch now, it'd be a waste. Ooh, that was a big kick. Yeah, I've been getting those a lot. So, oh, let's see. Horatio J on YouTube wants to know that when you donate for the Jacoby uh, Q, then you're automatically entered for the poison break and a chance at a ticket for the Moscone Cup. Uh, no, so this, uh, go ahead, Lopez. Well, I was going to say that when you donate for the Jacoby Q, those, that donation is also going towards being part, being the highest donator. Uh, so at least that part, yes. Uh, for the tickets, I'll let you explain that, Nate. So the, the tickets... Um... So the tickets, I'm ordering 40 tickets for the Moscone Cup. So of those 40 Moscone Cup tickets, you can claim them. You don't get them. I mean, you have to pay for them. But the idea is what we're doing with this is we are raising money, basically, to knock off the total price of 40 tickets. So if 40 tickets cost theoretically $1 each, um, and I'm going to say theoretically as much as possible just to mess with everybody. <laughs> Uh, the total purchase price would be $40. If we were to raise $30 during this stream, then the there would still need to be $10 paid between 40 people. So as long as you donate at least $5 to this stream, you are going to be one of the people who only have to pay for that, if that makes sense. So Does that make sense? Basically, if you donate to the stream, you, you, can, you are part of getting... Uh, of requesting a donate uh, a um, discounted ticket and it, yeah and, and you just the only all you have to do to request a ticket is send me a message saying hey i want two tickets reserved or five tickets or two reserved or one or whatever and you get to sit with the cool kids in the queue up group yeah jim's not a part of that just to be clear no i'll be on the other i'll be on the other side throwing tomatoes at you apples i thought it was pickles tomatoes i'm not oh. throwing my pickles away i'm eating my pickles he'll be eating those <laughs> Throw away those pickles. Those are gold. All right. How do I play this? Do I come? I got three, three rails. rails. Of course, three rails. I know. Well, actually, four is not bad. Well, you, four. I don't, go, I don't want to get. Any, I don't want to get anywhere. Not, I don't want to get anywhere near the bottom rail. Why not? Three rails or seven. Three reels, uh, Get off the rail. Get right. off the rail. Yeah, four reels was better. Nine, seven. That long. I say long. It's seven foot away. <laughs> no way, so. I think that's the first shot I've seen you take your medicine on. Stubborn. Oh, how'd he hit that one? Too hard. <laughs> I 
Oh, oh no! Just bobbled it. I actually heard a dog bark in the background there. When you hit that. Whoop. Oh, the just avoided the getting uh, kicked there. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the ball. Does the two pass the eight? Don't think it does. Oh, it's got a window. Has that got a it? window. Oh, it does. Got a window. It does. Oh, into the side, yes. Between the eight and the three. That's actually good because it allows them to use the, the three to slide down to the five. Thank you. Oh, oh. oh unless he does that. Oh, it's getting tough now. All right, Nate, you're up. I don't think you're going to last the third set, Jim. No, uh, my arm, my, my neck's going to not going to last the third set. I think you need to win it this set. Nine inside. Key I'm balls gonna, looking I'm safe to this time. Oh, whoa! Oh, I spoke. Oh my oh. goodness! I thought I spoke too soon. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been a gross scratch. <laughs> it would have. My goodness. What's the score? It is six Sixes. to six. Box cars. Uh, where's this three ball go? Just kind of. I'm gonna to, oh my goodness, this is this is not fun. Is this you, get, you get straight on the two and roll forward and get behind the three and play it in the bottom left. Get behind it where? Here? No, on the other side. Because isn't that the two uh, right there next to the two balls right here? The three balls right here. To get underneath it, I'd have to be right here. I mean, the the window's so small. Okay. Super small. The two Can't you run through into the eight? No. The two ball doesn't go into the past the seven ball. How about stopping complaining like a little girl and just play it into the top left? Just leave it left side of the eight ball and play it into the left corner. It's too hard. It's too hard of a shot. <laughs> The thing's basically hanging over the pocket. Well, forward, forward three, forward two, four, two rails, and play it in the same pocket as the two. Genius play. God, that is really tiny. That's 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 some good movement there to do that, right? You're gonna try to do something like this, I think. Such a small window. Uh, but what you're just uh, does that does that mean you're, what you're gesturing now? You're going to try to play the three in the top left. Well, I don't know. To be honest, I'm not even I'm not even hating the bang shot at this point. Get the cue ball back to where it is now, and you've got a nice two reeler. The angle, the angle, the angle's going up table. I'm drawing on this line. I mean, I can get it back to about right here. I'm going to play gym shot. Because I hate money. No, I'm not. Forward, forward two rails, other side of it. Not far enough. Not far enough. <laughs> not to bank it, is he? Oh, yeah, it. sexy pool. <laughs> Here, let's like just slide over for the six. Well, so you could have used a little bit more pace on that yeah. one. Soon he's missed. Missed it. Slightly overcut the ball. Not a very good player. I've just decided. Slightly. I don't think I've made a single one of those shots that today. Oh, just barely avoided that side pocket. But five ball down. Looks like one, one ball, ball down. down as well. That actually oh, that helps. Helps. Yeah, that actually helps a lot. Yeah. Changed the whole rack, that ball drop in. Uh, but the three to the five. What are you going to do here? Yeah, I'm going to put it back. Oh, thank you. Something says, <laughs> cut, cut on the shot on the, on the top rail near the nine. 
Yeah, play he's gonna the... go to the short rail now and come what, come back underneath to play the five in the the top right. Yeah, either. <laughs> no, I think he's run it all the way back down table. It's a goal oh, that's that's that didn't bite, did it? Same. Yeah. That didn't bite. It had dissipated. No. no. That's not going. I, I'm, I can't get my head straight over the queue anymore. I never had a head that was straight into me. I'm looking out my right eye. No. Hmm. Did you make enough balls on the break? No. <laughs> Two more and I'd have had a chance to run out. Come across okay. the three. Okay, so you're going to be what? You're going to go behind the eight to the side rail to come out for the six? Yeah. You got the five ball next. Oh, never mind. The five? I, th I thought that was the seven. <laughs> yeah, I did. Your camera's really shitty. So somebody gives all the players crap about the state of their cameras. So, what? I think the more. The more people that are coming in there now using the Wi-Fi, they're draining it slightly more, so his signal's going a bit worse, isn't it? Just the, 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 cam the, the camera doesn't have enough pixels to pick up his entire body. That was a problem. That was Probably it. it. Another missile ball. Well. Not far enough. Why don't you just play it for? Why don't you just play? I'm an the idiot. <laughs> yeah, you could still cut this in the side and play the ten in the corner, just like that. Well played. Definitely well played. And Nate retakes the lead. I'm doing my best to think as little as possible because when I kept on thinking in the beginning, it was just not good. So I'm just oh, playing reactionary yeah. cool. Nate, you're back up. Oh, Nito. Jim, should we just double the, if if I somehow what is the score? Seven six. Seven to six. You're taking. Oh fuck! Got I'm, the still, lead. I'm still going to lose from here. I'm running the next three, Nate. I'm not. Oh, seven ball went. Oh, my goodness. I'm so lucky. Oh, I thought I was going to break dry there. You got a, got a bit of a mess there over by the rack. It's no, it's weird. actually not bad. Everything goes. Oh, then it's a drill. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it pretty much is. This actually is like one of the easier racks I've had for a while now. Well, I shouldn't say that. It's not one of the tougher ones. I'd laugh if you missed the one. <laughs> you see, Somebody's perfect, asking me. Perfect timing when you said that. <laughs> uh, Patrick McKinney's asking what you're breaking off, Jim. Can you just describe it to him, please? Well, I'm breaking off. Yeah, oh, the black mat. Yeah, yeah, yeah the break mat. cloth. It's a community break mat. It's a, it's like a prototype. I don't know if you can buy them or not. Go ahead, Jim. Um, but it's a, a prototype that I was given. I'm just such a community good. representative. Protects your cloth, stops you from getting break marks on your uh, cloth. But you can just use a piece of paper works as well, or a, or a, or a piece of the cloth yeah. that's left over when you put your cloth on your table. Yeah, just to help keep uh, burn marks uh, from the break spot. Yeah. No, I like that one he's using, though, because it's a different color, easy to spot, easy to get out of the way quickly. Is that a dry right? break? It is. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. That's a scratch. That's... Oh, yeah. Oh, scratch, Jim. Okay. And so while we're waiting for Jim to 
rack. Here's another uh -huh. look at the Jacoby Custom Q and the Poison Break Q that you have a chance to win at the end of this event. So do get your donations in while you can. Another dry break. Dry again. Oh my goodness. Y'all are y'all aren't getting tired, are y'all? Dry, scratch, dry. Come on, night. I think I'm tired of always being an idiot. <laughs> Hold on, Abel. Hold on, Abel. What is the score? Six, uh, six? The score is seven to seven. six, you. Put you on the hill, Nate. Bit of incentive there for you. Good shot. Use the side rail to come back towards the middle of the table. Missed it. Oh, oh. an undercut. Wow. So, Jim, to go level. Dry again. I can get. I can't get down on the queue. Yeah, your your uh, the the uh, second row balls are coming up high on the side pockets now. Yeah, I can't. I'm not. Um, yeah, I'm not even. I'm not. My head's not even level on the queue. Can't get down. And there. I'm about as helpless as it gets, just because I suck. So we're having ourselves a match, and that's going to be dry too. This is so frustrating. All the viewers are enjoying it. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've like, I don't think I've ever, I, I don't think I've ever played this bad in my entire life. I mean, I, I feel so helpless. There we go with the uh, second row. Both of them down. Nice, decent spread. No clutters. On to the two, you think? Five's not in a very nice position either, Chris. Look, six is in the way. Yeah, but he can easily get um, on the three to play the five in the um, top right. Top, the top right, yeah. <laughs> kind of call is that? The All right, right call. <laughs> okay, now. It goes too it. far. He'll have it in the middle as well, so he's got a little bit of leeway on it, I guess. I think both of you are on drugs. Yeah, you're the one that's officially on drugs right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. I am. I, I am. I am actually loaded with the uh, ibuprofen. Uh, ibu so what? What do you have in mind here? It. Do you want to set up for the combination instead, or do you want to try to get underneath the four ball to play it in the bottom left? I was going to draw it, try and draw it around three rails and get up here somewhere. And get underneath it, okay. I'll draw it around two rails and go up there. I'm not playing the combi, that's a stupid shot. Well, maybe I will. <laughs> Have another tablet, you might. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Probably make it. Yeah, that's a good shot. No, it's not. Oh, he's done get away from us. You got to let the cue ball go with that one. Can you see it that's to the okay. bottom right? I yeah. can. It's okay. Let me. I can make it though. I can see the ball. I can't see the pocket. <laughs> what a stroke! Oh, unlucky. All right. This is fun. Nate, you're up. Let's Jim, get on, how let's much get, fun are we having? Let's get on the hill. Come on. Jim, are we having fun yet? I'm in a bit of pain. 
No, I don't want so much about fun, but yeah. Pain, yes. Yeah, I just saw the five ball go down, or the four pumps. <laughs> I'm used to uh, calling uh, Jim's Airman's Blacks. But the uh, four ball's down, and it looks like the five ball did go down. Yeah, five ball went into the side, got kicked in. Eight to the nine. It looks like you have a bit of a cut angle here and roll to the side rail and back out for the three in the right middle. Oh, he draws it underneath. Never mind. Is that one too? No, oh, I, just, I, I, I mean, I can't do anything. Rattled it in. I cannot do anything. I just, uh, I, I can't make a ball. I, I mean, I literally can't even see the, the cutting edge. All right, Jim, take it away. Still got 38 people watching though, guys. Come on. Oh, yeah. There you go. Put a oh, yeah, idiots. I'm trying my best, Mark. <laughs> We've got ten over on I was, YouTube. I, that, that wasn't aimed at you, Jim. It was aimed at the other one. Try, try closing, try closing your dominant eye and shooting with the other eye. See how yeah, many balls you miss. <laughs> I've actually thought about doing that as as an experiment because I I've no, played, it doesn't I, work. Trust yeah, I, I've I've played around with that before. It's it's really weird. That is weird. And I can't get my left eye over the queue at the moment without being in pain. Mm. Um, So I'm guessing the two goes in between the four and the ten. Yeah, straightforward draw up. Maybe just stun over to the side rail by the four and out. Oh, see, I, ca I called the Maybe. the I called the purple five the four. <laughs> Overhit that a bit. He wasn't trying to clip off the five ball. Yeah, I'm wondering if he's banking this now. Or whatever ball he clipped off, he wasn't trying to hit that. That's why he overhit it. He's playing speedy off of the, the right cushion. Cut to the side. Uh, well, that bank. came off long. Ooh. Came off really long. Very long. Just put a little wow. bit more pace on it to, to cut it down, and you would have had it. Came off real long. Jeez. That's the first bank you've tried, actually, Jim, tonight. That is the first bank I've tried on this on these rails. Yeah, it might be the last one as well. God, oh, mate, how many racks has it been since I actually got out of one? Up, get up. All right, this looks good here. We're, what, draw back for the... I can't tell if the six goes past the nine. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Might even run it round two rails here. Or off the side. Uh, you just do the one railer. If, if the six goes past the nine, you just do the one railer. Stop. Nice draw shot there. Must be like 11.28 p.m. where you are, Jim, right? Yep. So no, There we go, Nate. Then. We are on the hill. Eight to six. Okay, 
And that's a dry break. Nate, you have a chance to take the set. Jim, are we having fun yet? I think just so oh, everybody knows. With... <laughs> just so we know, I think everybody knows we are not doing a third set today. Right, Jim? Um, You're in way too much pain for it. I can, I mean, I can tell. Right. Then let, if you if you want to, then it's going to have to be a short one. I can't I, I can't play another nine. Play two. No. Uh, play two I'm three. dying here. Yeah. Oh, this is gross. That two ball tied up next to the ten. Yeah, and the magic or the the turtle raccoon kept them together. I mean, I guess I shouldn't say it kept them together, but it looks like it kept them together. <sighs> So are Real you gonna, stinky. Is it's gonna try to break it out time. here? Yeah, that's what he's trying. Right shot. But now what? No, but <laughs> it would have been no, it would have been really good if the, if, the, if the turtle rack wasn't there. I'd have had a straight in combination. The the two ball rolled off the magic rack or the yeah, the turtle rack at the last second. Oh, good shot. Oh, dear. Oh, it's okay. He can double. Yeah. He can get the cue ball back where he's at so he can yeah. still play the three. Yeah. Or at least on that line for the three. I even have the angle to nudge in it. Here he comes. Don't overdo yeah, it, though. Okay. It's fine. Perfect. Sort of a thick hit on this, right? A man on a mission in a hurry look. Oh no. Oh, Slow down, cue ball. Oh, oh gosh. Just a bit too much pace on that one. Oh dear. Oh, where's the five, five ball? Yes, here it comes. There it goes. Four rail up. That is, now look at this. That is one of the four balls you expect to fall on the uh, ten ball rack. Yeah, the wing ball going four rails, right, Chris? Yep. The try the ball at the back of the rack, right? All nine Ooh. balls actually have um, predictable paths depending upon the starting position of the cue ball um, on the break. Uh, but with Jim doing more of a center break, he's betting on the, the balls in the second row to head towards the side pockets and then for the corner balls to go four rails into their respective quarter pockets, or at least head towards them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But even the balls that are in the third row have a predictable path, and then the, um, the, the two balls in the last row in the middle um, have a predictable path as well. <laughs> Pushes forward because he's going to play the two in the bottom left. Roll forward for the three. Yeah, as far as you like on this three, doesn't matter. Four ball open it. Just a nice, slow, draw, draggy shot here. Get the cue through. Just like that. Beautiful. Get yeah, no, off the rail. I thought he was, I, I would have thought he would have hit that with a little bit more pace so that doesn't happen. He's all, I think he, he's okay. I think he can draw it above the nine. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I'm watching the Facebook feed. Yeah. I think he can, I think he can just bend, twist this round slightly, can't he? It's a, it's a hard twist if he does. He's, he's probably better off trying to jump it if, if, he, if, his, uh, if his shoulder can yeah. take it. Wow, yeah. I was going to say, that's why I didn't think he'd want to jump it. Yeah, I don't need the shoulder. I'm going to, I'm going to pencil it. Oh, are you going to dart it? I'm going to dart it, then I don't need my shoulder. What do you want? Uh, oh, oh no. just missed it. Oh, valiant Jump. effort. Jumps, jumps the ball too easy, Jim. You missed that ball because you, uh, like because, that. You, because you flew it too far. If that ball lands, if, I, if that ball lands one inch sooner, he makes it center cup. But because it's it's in the air again, it's making contact with the ball at the top of the ball and not the, the bottom. We're talking about jumping, Nate. What was the advice you gave to Kelly, or don't you want to tell anyone? Um, 
I'm going to scratch again. That's so gross. It's dry anyways. I gave her a, I mean, we were, I went through my jumping lesson with her. So the full lesson or the abbreviated full lesson. Everybody, here's another look at the Jacoby Heritage 3 custom queue that you have a chance to win via raffle. Um, every $5 donation gets you an entry into the raffle. All of the ways to donate are in the pinned comment on Facebook and the top comment on YouTube. And to the highest donator will go the poison break queue here that you see at the bottom. Can you guys hear me? Or am I muted? No, we can hear you. Oh, okay. Nine ball down, four ball down, seven ball down. It's a pretty good break. Three to the five is the closest. Uh, I guess. Uh, I was gonna say yeah, probably three to the five is the closest thing to work. I would say. Well, no. You don't want to get. Uh, you're just gonna slide over. You don't want to get jacked over the eight. That's really the only thing here. Nope, he's fine That's here. Good shot. Strike again. You need to decide if you want to go drag it down the table, if he wants to come off two rails. Yep. I don't think you want to play short side in the six. You can. You have to go twice across his knee. Yeah, Zigzag. I think that's the right shot. Oh, that slidey cloth. The slidey cloth got him. He's okay. But it worked out just fine. Yeah. The slidey cloth uh, lengthened out twice off both rails. He got a lot closer to it, didn't he, Nate? Than I thought he would. Zip. Nice shot, Jim. Ah, this is good. Jim, you're good. Don't hurt yourself. This is good. Count that point. I don't know what it is. He, makes it, point, he yeah. makes it anyway. <laughs> yeah. well, I, I mean, if he's stretching like that, I mean, there's no reason to potentially hurt it. Uh, but uh, Eric Croft is wondering to know what's up with uh, Jim's shoulder. Well, he said that he, uh, he slept on it wrong, and then during a um... – during one of his ghost uh, tournament matches that he had over the weekend, during a jump shot, he just he just felt that he pulled it, and uh, it's been hurting ever since, right, Jim? Yeah, yeah, it was going to. It's right up the back of my head and right down my shoulder, and um, it's okay when I'm just standing doing nothing. But as soon as I get over the queue, then it's difficult for me to get my, to get my head into the position where I normally have it without it hurting. And it was, I took some painkillers and it was okay at the start, but it's just getting worse and worse as we go along. Yep. It's Nate's fault. He told me I had to break hard. Nate making short work of this rack. Is this for the win, is it? This will be it helps when you make four balls off the break. Yeah, that's a nice shot there. And Nate takes the set down. What do you think, Jim? You wanna you wanna try and do maybe a rubber match later on? How about we just do uh is a race ten minute ten, ten minute run as many as you can. Is it well Jim, that's gonna make it worse on you, man. Because then you're not gonna have time to really take your time when you're going down on stuff. Well, I tell you what, everybody, let's just take a small break here. Nate, why don't you go ahead and plug yeah, we everything? Take, we, take a little, we take a little break and we figure out what we're going to do here. Cause yeah, we'll think about it. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, uh, Lil Chris, you want to give the plug? Uh, sure. So before we go on break here, if you want to get your donations in for a chance to win a Jacoby uh, custom queue here, the top one here is the Jacoby Heritage 3, and what you see on the bottom there is a Poison Break Cube. 
All the ways to donate to the stream are in the pinned comment on Facebook and the top comment on YouTube. Every $5 donation gets you an entry into the raffle for the Jacoby Heritage 3. But then whoever donates the highest amount um, at the end of the event here will automatically win the Poison Q. I do believe Nate said he's going to draw or uh, do the raffle sometime this weekend. So we'll be taking. Yeah, it'll be Saturday or Sunday. We'll be taking donations up to that point. And so it doesn't have to be a single high donation. It could be a collection of donations. So if you donate more than once to the uh, the stream, every donation will be tallied up. And whoever has the most when we do the drawing will be the winner of the Poison Break queue. So with that, we're going to take a small break here and figure out what we're going to do with the next set. Don't go away. Share, share, share. Donate, donate, donate. Ah, oh, Jim, I thought you were going to complete it. <laughs> Okay, we are back. So what we're going to try to do here to finish off our exhibition match here is we're going to do a race to five, but dry breaks will be okay. They'll, the the uh, player will still have the option to take ball in hand and attempt to run the rack. Uh, this is to help uh, Jim out with his shoulder here. So Nate's going to start us off in this race to five. Take it away, Nate. One ball down, or nine ball down. He, t well, Nate is usually the one that takes off at the beginning of the set, and then Jim slowly starts to catch him. Uh, so over on uh, the YouTube, I've got a question from uh, Bang Time Pool. He wants to know what the highest bid is. I currently do not know as I'm trying to run the stream in the background. I'm going to have to tally this all up um, at the end. Actually, it's probably close. To, it's probably it probably is close to 200. <laughs> if if I were just to make my uh, my best guess. Nicely done there. I want to give a shout out to Eve's Day Mongolia. Thank you for your donation. Mm 
Nate off to a strong start already. <laughs> You'd almost think we didn't you, you almost think we didn't change any of the rules. <laughs> Well, there was there was a there was a rally during the the last set where uh, Jim was breaking dry and you were scratching on the break like back to back. I think so. Uh oh. I think I'm drinking the 60 minute. It's probably about six and a half percent, I would guess. Seven percent. Wow, that's strong. Thank you for the reminder there, Nada, because oh, I was the only person that they were hearing for a minutes. second. <laughs> so that is my mistake. Gin and Nate. <laughs> yeah. But everybody should be heard now. Rookie move. Rookie move, Chris. Ah, my bad. <laughs> Are we back? Well, you've been <laughs> back. It's just that they could only hear me at the time. <laughs> I just told all my best jokes as well in the last three minutes. <laughs> all gone to waste. Well, the good part about, well, the, the, you don't have any good jokes. You did tell all, all your good ones. <laughs> See what I did there? Thanks, mate. All right. What are we doing with our lives? All right. That's not a good idea. Yeah. Let's make it as difficult as we can. Dot com. I I just have to live up to to Nate's stream. There's there's got to be at least a couple of mistakes that happen here and there, right? It's got to be. Man, I hit that ball bad too. It was actually going very well up until then, Chris. <laughs> I try. I try. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Man, I'm a good player. And a bit too much pace on that one. Let's see how well you back cut, huh? Ten's gonna go close as well. Oh, how'd he hit that one? Another back cut. Bad, is it? That's not bad. The cats will be very proud of Daddy. Oh, ho, 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 that was beautiful. Let's have a few cat puns, shall we? That wasn't a poor shot, was it? That was a great shot. Let's get some puns going, Chris. We've been very short on puns this evening. It's not getting up above it. It's a very poor effort. Whoops. It's, it's a very poor effort. Lengthen. No. Oh, wait for it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> it's a very, very, very poor effort. There we go. So as we said, dry breaks do not matter. Ball in hand, protective mm -hmm. cloth away. Window between the five and the eight for the two. So just run this through into the side. He's going to draw it instead into the corner. Nice big window, centre table. Nicely played. Draw shot here. Just to be a little bit careful. He doesn't want to. He's got a bit of an angle. He doesn't want to get hooked behind the five yeah. ball. That's the thing here, isn't it? Yeah. Choose to play it even harder to come away from it. Nah, it's played it Nicely nice. done. 
Let me see a big struck here. Yep, because uh, what he's got to get to the four to go into the side. side pocket. He really wants. He really wants to be all the way down the table, kind of by his uh, his uh, where he just had his break spot from. Oh, he's played that well. Oh, how'd he hit it? That's pretty good. Uh, just see, he's move, moving he gingerly. That ball. Just moving gingerly when he gets down, isn't he? I think he's yeah. in more pain than he's letting on. Typical Scotsman. Yeah. Tough. Look in here, Chris. Pretty good, I think. Uh, the the two ball looks questionable. <laughs> and if the two ball goes, it's like into a third of a pocket. Yeah, because the three ball blocks a pretty good chunk of the the top left pocket there. It almost seems like you might as well just set up for the two ten combo so you can spot it. Or he can play the two onto the six if he wants. Another. Well, yeah, that's choice. possible if he wants to try to zigzag his way over there. Could even make both both balls there and keep himself on the three. That's freezing right on the eight ball. That's such a so crazy buddy. shot. I knew those. Kick, uh, kick, kick the 210 combo. Oh, man. See if he makes this now, Chris. I'm saying I'm leaving this meeting. <laughs> Went for Filler. <laughs> Went for the Josh Filler. Exactly what I played. Can't play anything I plan. Such a. Well controlled on the white ball that time as well. Well, see, the thing that I've noticed, um, and I, I noticed it all through the VG events, and uh, even with Jim's break, since he's breaking more from the middle, you'll notice the balls that are in the third row, they just go to the side rails and then clutter back up like they are right now next to the 10 ball, unless they have enough pace, because then they just cross all the way back over and separate from one another. Yeah. Yeah, good spot. So, Nate, I do hear some music, so I'm going to mute you now. Yeah, I actually like that tune. Yeah, but we, we, we don't want we don't want the uh, the music to affect the stream. <laughs> uh, of course not. I can't remember. That two ball is really ugly. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh. It's even more ugly from there. See the edge of it? Yeah, I can. He's going to fire at this. Oh, flick off the eight ball right into the side pocket. <clears throat> All right, Nate, you're up. Oh, I broke dry. It's okay. Matter. Dry breaks don't matter. Doesn't matter. Mate. Oh yeah, that's right. Easy game, this. Oh, this is not great though, is it? Well, at least your two ball has a path to a pocket now. Yeah, that's a, that's a thing. But see the same thing, Mark. Look at look at Nate's uh, two, eight, and ten. Just like with Jim's, they all they all stay next to the to the rack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they just go straight to the straight to the side rails and then come back. So where are they in the rack at the beginning? They're, uh, they're in the third row uh, with the ten third ball. Third row, right? Yeah. That's not gonna get there either, man. Uh, really? Oh. Yeah, I think Nate's struggling with the pace of the table as well. That's not the quickest table, is it? We've seen. Yeah. Well, it's, he's, it's, only, he's only he's only been playing on it for four hours. 
<laughs> well, the, the problem is, is with it, it's extremely, extremely humid today in Wisconsin, and with the place filling up, it's just getting really, really humid, and I'm not adjusting to that. It's slowing down quite a bit. Mm. Do you want to borrow my break, Q? Do you want to borrow my jump, Q? No. Better than yours. Yeah, you need a side view for this my, one. My key was better than yours. <laughs> Man, I wish Neither I was one that, of that. God, eat a salad once in a while. That, that, that <laughs> table is going to be about a foot away from the other one if he keeps nudging it like that. <laughs> say, Stop. Don't sit on it, mate. That's going to have a hell of a roll. Now you're going to complain your next rack that the table's rolling off. Oh, oh, he just bobbles it. Oh, my goodness. So much work went into that as well. Yeah. The pain that you put that table through just for that miss. Watch out for that side pocket, Jim. Take it big. Oh, that's better. There's no way I'm getting out. There's no way in the world I can pop what, nine balls in a row. In my defense, Jim, I wanted to stop. Well, it's me. We did want to stop. But we, we promised people a result, so we'll give them a result. Well, who's, who's going to get mad about doubling the bet and uh, running it back? We can get some backers involved then. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. You might get some people backing you now. Yeah. Yeah. Who wants? Who wouldn't want that action you now? All I know is I need Kyle Boucher to order me another beer. I'm out again. Somebody call my bar and order me a drink so I don't have to walk 12 feet. That's a good shot. Oh, that's Speed. a really good shot. Don't get, don't get straight. Give yourself that angle. Nice, right, fine. You can draw it out. Draw it. All you have to do is just get over to the left rail. Yeah, you're not enough rail. You to punch it up table. Yep. We're going to see three rail above the seven. There it is. Easy game. Oh, <clears throat> I like a, a ferret just like that ran over by a truck. <laughs> Thanks for the sympathy, you prick. <laughs> Ian says the breach can give the blackout the last two. Depends who's holding it. Well, you can't argue with that now, can you? Oh, a nice smooth draw shot there, Jim. That's a good out, Jim. That's a good idea. How, how long has it been? How long has it been since I got out of Iraq? 45 minutes. <laughs> it's been I mean, Mark's, Mark's talking shit, but it's probably pretty close to true. <laughs> I rarely talk anything else, Nate. I think I went about an hour and a half in between the first and second set. Where I, don't think I, I don't think I ran one. Uh, this is a mess. It's actually not well. I'm not going to say anything because last time I said that, I think I made two balls and then well, put does, myself like a dope. Does the three, the three ball go? Uh, pass the oh, four. it doesn't. Yeah. Oh shit! I honestly thought the three ball went. Oh, this is an easy game. Who is that one from? I don't know. Someone said I was supposed to call and get another beer. Oh, awesome! Somebody <laughs> called and ordered me another beer. When's somebody going to give me a drink? Oh, me. Uh, I don't. I think I think your wife's had loads of drinks bought for her team. <laughs> yeah, probably. Seen. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this one short again, just for fun. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, that looks good. Oh, are that you, looks are you, nice. Are you gonna try to bump into the three or bump into the four? I don't know. Well, so I'm gonna. I'm, I'm thinking about hitting the gap and playing the three to the top left. Ooh. Okay. Because you bump into the three, you probably can play it in the bottom right. You bump into the four, you can play the three into the side. Good call, Chris. 
I have too much angle to get to the four ball. The best I can do is the right side of the three, okay. which is the so right shot anyways. Because then I'm like this. Yeah. I suppose when you're actually commentating, Chris, we could say it's table talk, couldn't we? Yeah. I missed it. <laughs> I missed it and it wasn't close. Oh, that's okay. That's worked out just. Oh, he's missed the two. Yeah, missed that two. worked out real good, four. didn't it? <laughs> I was watching the three ball. Well, you should have been watching the third diamond because that's where I shot the two ball into. You should have been watching the two ball because then you wouldn't have missed it. Yeah, that's a good call, Larry. Larry says there should be a, a row of shots around the table anyway. You shouldn't have to keep asking for drinks. Yeah, then he says, oh. drink after you shoot. The first one to pass out loses. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be Jim, the amount of... Uh, the amount of people I've pumped into him tonight. Oh, I wonder. Yeah, I was just wondering if he could nudge into the nine there and stay for the four. I think that's what he was playing. It's gone wrong. <laughs> I think we're going to start. Where's Ian? Where's Ian when you need him? The Ian, top. I know you're watching. Tell him, uh, tell him he needs a propel for this. say he deserves to make one of these. He's yeah, been good hop, good now. hop, but an overcut on the jump. It seems to be jumping very easy, though. Oh, I scratched. Yeah, never a doubt. Scratch. Never a doubt. You're back on again, Jim. <clears throat> never a doubt. All right, so let's take a second here to show you off these lovely cues here. We have the top one here, the Jacoby Custom Heritage 3 that is being raffled off um, after this event here for every $5 donation gets you a ticket into the raffle. And then the highest donator at the end of the event here will win the poison break cue that you see here at the bottom. All the ways to donate are in the pinned comment on Facebook and is the top comment on YouTube. And all of the money goes back to the, to the people because we are buying tickets for everybody to go to Moscone Cup that wants to. And if you don't share, 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 tonight, 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 we're going to send the boys round. It's not too bad. It's pretty nice. I would say the, uh, maybe the five to the six is. That's pretty much the most work is the five to the six. Uh, and really it's not bad. You just, you just got to decide which side of the six you want to be on. Yep. You don't really want to bring the nine ball into play. Yeah, get the cue through this one nice and low. Just like that. Nice shot so there. Loud in here. Oh, what, does, he, does he have the angle to go to the side rail and come between the, the four and the eight? Or the, I mean the, the the five and the eight, or uh, he'll he'll drop he'll, he'll drop to the drop right where his cue is. Right where his cue is, okay. Yeah, the the the, the high inside spin isn't even sh uh, the shot isn't even available on his table because the cloth is too new. He'll never get enough side spin. He has to draw it over. Gotcha. He won't have that shot available for probably another three or four hundred racks. He's got to hold on. Now, it's it's always fine. a pretty sight to see when the cue ball hesitates when it's got backspin on it, and then it finally takes off. That slidey cloth. Mm -hmm. got, a, got a question for you, Nate. What what kind of period is your peak time for a cloth? So f from the time you get it, so then you, you're you just saying 400 racks well, to break it in. Then how long, yeah. how many racks have you got out of it? It kind of depends. 
Yeah, I was going to say it kind of depends on the player. It kind of depends on what player, what who's the player, and what they're trying to get out of their cloth. But well, let's say Jim. I would say about two to two hundred and fifty racks is where the cloth plays the best. I think. Depending, uh, two. I mean, two weeks doesn't really mean all that much, Jim. If, uh, if it's you playing during like a busy no, yeah. season, yeah. Two weeks of how much I play, yeah. Okay. I, mean, I, I like, oh. I personally, I think the peak starts at about 250 racks is when it, that's when it starts playing really good. Uh, one and a three are tied up. Fun. Or I mean, it's three and the six are tied up. Yeah, even though it's dry, it doesn't matter. We. We've skipped that rule for this final set. Everything's kind of crappy here. The eight and the ten are tied up, but three and the six. We'll judge that well. Uh, he's a bit straight on this. How's he going to get to the three? Karen, maybe? Three, six, Karen. That's it. That's what he tried. So, Jim's Larry uh, Roizen, thank you for the 145 stars. Well, All right, let's go, Jim. You got a four. really nice spread here. Yeah, just three to the four, Chris, isn't it? Yeah. Favoritism much? Looks like it. Sounds like it too. <laughs> I'm rooting for both of y'all. I'm rooting for Jim. Jim needs this more than I do. Jim needs if I, <laughs> if, if, Nate, if Nate beats Jim, that might be the end of his career. I have no career, Paul. <laughs> is that the is that the running joke now after after Jim beat uh, Darren? <laughs> okay, the speed did you hit that? How <laughs> oh, well did he hit that ball? <laughs> he hit that one, all right. Perfect speed. Oh, he's one of them shots. That, that's that's free stroking it right there for you. Yeah, he hasn't got to do a lot. Come on, Jim, let's see your lefty game. Play it left-handed, behind the back, <laughs> under the leg, anywhere. We can play <laughs> oh, yeah. Do you, do you really think I feel like being a contortionist at the moment? <laughs> let's, let's, let's bend my body in unnatural shape. It already feels like it's bent in an unnatural shape. <laughs> uh, why would you want to be anywhere else right now? That's a pretty good elf. Yeah, really nice. I'm not there yet. No. Oh, shut you're, your mouth. You're, you're there. You can make that with one uh, with both your eyes closed. <laughs> oh, six ball go. Yay, good for me. Doesn't oh, matter. Two ball, you're always so stinky. Doesn't it pass the ten for the top left? Who yeah, but that's so ball? hard. Look where the look where the one ball is. How am I ever gonna get to there? <laughs> push to the side. Push to the side rail. I play a push out. <laughs> What's the score? It What's is, the score? It's one to two. One. You, Jim. Am I winning? Yes. Nate, yeah. you're, get, you're getting beat by a cripple. I know. <laughs> you need this more than I do, Jim. I can just draw back for the three so you can stand underneath the nine. No, I got the wrong angle to draw got, it. I got to go the, forward. You got the wrong angle? You're going to run into the eight if you try to draw it? No, I'm coming oh, down the table this way. I got to get the cue ball oh, all the way to here. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I got to get the cue ball to here before I start getting it. Um, here before I start getting a shot on the three. I can't draw to the... That's that's the camera for you. It looks, it looks almost straight to us. Forward two rails. Stop, 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 stop. He's done that's, well to get that. That's a good Perfect. shot. Shot of the night for you, Nate. No, oh, stop. I made a jump shot. It was the jump wow, shot. Apart from that. 
<laughs> apart from that. Jim, it's all the night followed up by the mess of the night. I'm not even going to tell you that's the laugh that you just had, Chris. I'm not even going to tell you what that sounded like. Oh, really? <laughs> Short the night followed by the mess of the night. Lil Chris, mute, mute the desktop audio and tell me when I can say this. <laughs> All right, that would be now. Oh, my. <laughs> it fucking better not. It did not, but that did. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I literally started like burst out laughing during that shot. <laughs> this is tough action. This is tough action. I feel like this uh, this dry break thing really just favors the heck out of Jim. Oh yeah, I really feel that this this uh, disabled shoulder of mine really favors the heck out of you. You want to swap? What? Well, I think swap? that I think that my inability to make three balls in a row really favors you. So that's true. But that favored me at the start of the match as well. That's fair. Nothing's changed there, huh? I should probably get uh, caught up with my thank yous. I got to give a uh, a giant thank you to Chris Henry. Thank you very much. And Tom Kosha, thank you very much as well for donations. Now I'm caught up, I think. Yep. Makes and me happy. I'm still all caught up on PayPal. Make us uncaught up so that we can buy more Moscone Cup tickets for people. Well, that's oh, up to, you the, under that's up to that. the viewers. Oh, my goodness, Jim. You underdrew the heck out of that. No, I, I, I overdrew it. I want to be no, hooked. I wanted you to be hooked underneath the nine and the six ball. Oh. <laughs> You're a horrible person. <laughs> that is also true. Oh, that looks like a lovely cut shot to me. It does look nice, doesn't it? I can't see that. I, can't, I, <laughs> cannot, I cannot get my head to see the edge of that, but it wouldn't surprise me if I actually completely missed the four. <clears throat> Good night, Laura. Laura's going to bed. Oh, Jim, you're overcutting it. I can tell. <laughs> Perfect. Get in there. Watch the oh. cue ball. Oh, unfriendly flick off of the five. That was not a friendly tickle. Wow. Actually, I knew I had to play it with effect, but all I... But I, I lined up behind it just to find the spot in the middle of the cue ball that yeah. gave me a chance of making it and just played it plain ball because using effect, <laughs> I didn't have a clue where I was hitting it. It's almost remarkable how, like, crappy my racks come out every time. I'll stop moaning. Look at my rack. Said the actress to the bishop. <laughs> Is he trying to thread the cue ball between the three and the whatever that ball is? Uh, it looks like the three nine ball. Nine. Which one? No, he, he just pushed it forward. You're fine, Nate. Oh, I'm just trying to guarantee myself an angle on this so I can break this five and five ball and hope I get a shot. Missed it. Oh. Wasn't close. Good planning, though, because you definitely Hammond. needed to do something like that. Otherwise, you wouldn't have been able to finish the rack anyway. He, yeah. he's, but he, all the concentration was on the cannon, wasn't it? No, all the concentration was like maintaining my status of being a total dork. <laughs> <laughs> Mission accomplished. Which I think I uh, maintained quite properly. 
You do that better than anybody I know. Oh, it's just the five past the nine, hopefully. It looks like it does. So one to the two. Two past is the eight, no problem. Just to... Well, it doesn't look too bad, does it now? We get a shot clock. Oh, Got to make the wall. Get in there. Oh, whew. wipe his feet on the way in. Did you just slop another ball in? Oh, it rolled. Nice shot, rolled Chris off. Off. Some say it's going in cleanly. Wiped his feet. Nice shot, Josh. Uh, Nate, you might be able to at, uh, answer this question. So this is a question from Stop. YouTube from Bang Time Pool. He wants to know where can you get a Q-Tech shirt like the one you're wearing? Uh, get with me. Second hand store. <laughs> Second hand store. <laughs> Get with me, I can get you one. What he actually said was, where can I get a shape, a shirt like Nate's, but about 12 sizes smaller, is what he mm. said. Oh, goodness gracious. <sighs> Such rude. Such rude you all are. Okay, so this looks like he's playing for the five to go into the side pocket. Uh, Watching you play tonight, Nate, I fancy my chances against you. Oh What's boy. the bet? What's the bet? Yeah, I'll have to think about it. <laughs> <laughs> this is an exhibition after all. Anybody can win for free. Oh, good shot. Oh, how well he played that. So, Push forward to the side rail and back out to the middle for the eight. Yeah, this is looking good now. It's going to take him to, what's he on now? He's currently on two. Yeah, so this will put him two away. Draw back slightly and have to do it again. Slight at the wrong angle. Shaking his head. So he must be too straight. Does he have does he does he just draw it and, or does he just stop it and take his medicine on it or does he try to power draw it just to get position if he's too well, straight? I was gonna say, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you if, if his shoulder was fine, he'd be drawing it off the bottom pushing two rails. Yeah, exactly. You're right. Exactly. <laughs> I know, You're right. I know. Exactly. No, you'd be drawing you'd be drawing it to the right of the ten ball, two rails. Not a nice the... stroke on it, Jim. Just stop the cue balls, what he'll probably end up doing. Yep, yeah. take, his, take his medicine on this one. Nothing wrong with this shot. This is the pocket he's been missing all the shots into, though, so who knows? <laughs> I was going to say, that's only when it's the seven ball. <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah. I'm trying to talk him into it. Ten yet. I've only missed like ten sevens. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, this one stayed open. He held the cue ball pretty good on that one. It didn't get kicked this time. Yeah, I move. I move my cue ball. Um, I I move my cue ball um, over during this because I was making balls over further, and I was breaking dry. So I've been break breaking from right here, but I I like to break from right here. So I move back over to here, and I I don't know. I just control my cue ball better from that spot for whatever reason. Since the since the dry break doesn't really mean anything at this point. Fight going on in there. Yeah, I was saying that got really loud. Oh, don't hit the jaw. Oh. oh, you hit that really good. Nicely done. The setup now off the short rail for the five in the uh, side pocket. Or are you, you, you going to spin it? it are you going to spin it hard enough to get to the corner? Nah, I'm going to have to spin it with inside and just kill it off the bottom rail. Yeah. Be careful here, though. I didn't, I didn't expect you to get that close to the ball. I didn't have enough angle to hold it. I had to try to come up into the six. Ah, okay. Oh, come oh. on! God, Bro, those pockets pocket. are tight. If I had a gym's, tape, gym's pockets, I would have went. 
So, Jamie, right, my pockets are tighter than those you're on. Yeah, but yours are slippery. That's true. So, right. I saw the three on ball the hill, go down. Chris. Say again? Jim to go on the hill here. Yes. Crazy. It's got some, they, the transitions look fairly simple, except for, I can't tell that, yeah, the two's got to go into the side. Four goes past the seven, I think. If not, it goes into the side. No problem, obviously. You've got half a pocket past the seven. Okay. okay. If that's what he plays for, that makes it uh, fairly simple to get to the five uh, there for his top left pocket. Uh, he's going to play it into the side. He's going to the four ball. Oh, either way, it's still the, 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 from the five from the four to the five uh, doesn't look too difficult. I wonder if he might stun over for the four into the same pocket here. Center ball punch shot. Yeah. Yeah. Looking at something like this. I like that. Yeah, that's the shot I like. Keep the stroke the same. Very nicely played. Just need to get between the six and the seven. Don't run it at the six. Just like Easy that. game. Nice and jacked up, just for fun. Say, what's he gonna do? Come around like this for the six, yeah. maybe? Just, just go up to about the. It's you just cut it in and go up to about the third diamond. Probably something like this, because I'm, I'm center ball. I, I, I'm drawing now. <laughs> yeah, it's just a, it's just a center ball here. Just get up towards the third diamond on the left rail. Yeah. Just like that. Oh, I was pretty Good accurate enough. on that one. Just luck moment. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's see if I let's see if I guess the next one right. And this slidey coffee, you almost got. It. Oh, oh Jim, look at so that! Y'all are gonna have to watch the replay. I'm guessing this exactly. <laughs> oh, What's that? Give this man a coffee mug to put on his head for how special he is. <laughs> Nicely done there. Tell you what, Jim, you're getting some good practice with the rest tonight, mate. Yeah, I know. I'm not stretching any. <laughs> Obviously, us, us Europeans have played a lot of snooker, so we're used to using those implements a lot more. Oh. Oh, put some pace behind that one. A real player with three rail distance of the, the right middle. Jason Shaw was scratching here. Oh, oh, yeah. no. oh, no. oh, you did not go there. Too you did soon. not just go there. Too soon. Too soon. <laughs> just, in case he's, just in case he's watching. Too soon. <laughs> Nicely done, Jim. You are now uh, on Jim. the hill. I'm only joking, Jay, if you're watching. <laughs> Oh, uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> that was a good shot. <laughs> well, uh, comes the jump cue. Oh, oh, do it again. <laughs> do it again, Jim. Uh, Nate, keep it in your hand. <laughs> He's used that more tonight than he has his own cue, his other cue. Oh, oh I just barely you... missed that one. When you shoot his here. There you go. I'll make it the second time. I always make these the second time. Just for funsies. Just kidding. Well, I, I let everybody see that. All right. <laughs> so Jim on the hill then. Yep, this could be this for, for the, the win. For the match. Oh, please let it be over. <laughs> That's what I think. You took the words right out of my mouth, Jim. Oh, wow. What a shot that is. Oh, Jim. 
Something a, something a bit funky. Yeah, lovely shot. Oh, Beautiful sick. shot. As long as it holds on. Yeah, great shot. Sexy pool. <sighs> oh, oh Ooh, holy Slow cow! Down. No speed control. Well, you, you just want to practice your banks, that's all. Yeah, yeah some of that. How wide the last one went, Jim. Yeah. Make sure to bank this one nice and short. Like that. Perfect. Beautifully. Go on this one again. Just like that. Left hand English swing, swinging it over beautifully played. Yep. Probably just a little bit of a draw, six inches or so. Beautifully again. done. Keep it coming, though. Oh, we got a tester. I'm going to be playing this into the left-hand corner. Yep. No. Yeah, oh, no, he tried no, to back cut it. No. Damn it, Jim. Oh. <sighs> I've never rooted for somebody so hard in my life. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, Jim, Chris Henry is asking that those – or first stating those rails are very responsive, but that's what he wants for his tables. He wants to know what kind of rails those are and where where can he get them. Uh, clever. Clever rails. Uh, tell him to send me a message and I'll, I'll let him know. There you go, Jim. Did you scratch? Well, oh. All right. So back on over to Jim. If he okay. sends me a message, I'll uh, I'll send him the information he needs. And while Jim is rocking up for this here, here's another look at the Jacoby Heritage 3 that we're raffling off at the end of this event. All the ways to donate are in the pinned comment on Facebook and the top comment on YouTube. Every $5 donation gets you an entry into the raffle, and the highest donator at the end of the event will win the poison break cue that you see at the bottom. All right, well, I guess I'm done using my, uh, now the music's super fucking loud, so I guess I'm just going to mute myself the rest of the time. Hopefully not too bad. Yeah, we can't really hear it here. It was, yeah, you could barely hear it. It wasn't, was it as noticeable as, as before? <clears throat> How many times this tube all going to sit there? Combo, maybe. Combo. The combi. 210 combo! 210 combo for Jimbo. Timber will come up, of course. Yeah, but <laughs> does it tie up next to the eight <laughs> when he respots it? I think it might just spring past that, Chris. I'm not quite sure. I think it's going to spring past the eight yet. Yeah. Not bad. Oh, so but how do you play position for the two? There's pool knowledge for you right there, knowing where yeah. the two ball was going to go and plays position for it. Beautifully played. I think he really wants to run this rack now, get it over with. Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> Get off there. Draw straight straight back. Draw now. Yeah, straight back for the five. Oh, he's hit that beautifully. 
really felt that one. Two rail this may be. Past the eight ball. Nicely done there. I think the eight ball goes to the bottom left. It does indeed. Perfect angle on the six just to draw over. No, I don't go too straight. That's okay. It can get back out of the rail. <clears throat> Thrones from Jim. Okay, so it looks like he's got plenty of room there just to go up to the short rail and come back down for the nine. I don't know if he's going to spin it two rails or not. I think he probably will. All right, there's that. Nine yeah, into the top right. Yeah, this is looking good. Straight. Off to the side rail and back out for the 10 in the bottom left. It's perfect, Chris, isn't it? Oh, no, he's straight, isn't he? Never mind, he's straight. I really, I, I really want to play an exhibition shot, but I just want this to be finished now. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to come all the yeah, way just, around Jim, just get it over back with. of the 10. <laughs> he wants to come all the way around the back of the 10. He's what he would love to play, I guess. Oh, he's doing it. Look at this. He's doing it. Oh, oh look that at was this so good. How did he How hit well it? has he hit that? And then he misses the 10 ball. Can you believe <laughs> it? <laughs> Before he even shoots it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness how could you do that mark how could you do that <laughs> uh, i don't think he was gonna miss that oh my goodness oh, oh man my so God. how do we want to do this nate you got so much music in the background if you want to come over by uh, your side camera here i've got i've got both of y'all on, on 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 the stream just go ahead i'm not gonna be able to talk all right well, here you are we can hear you we can hear you good fine it's it's the music that's in the background. We don't want to get copyright striked for the for the music. But I can't hear the music, can we? No, I I, I can. Oh, you can, can you? Yeah. All right. So, well, Jim, like, you battled your way through that one, man. Your shoulders got to be killing you. Uh, it's pretty. So I, I think I'm. Uh, I think that's me. Probably a good three or four days that I won't be on the table anymore after that. It's a uh, it's pretty painful. But look, I, look, we said we were going to do it tonight. Um, Nate had actually said. That he was going for his COVID shot uh, today or yesterday, and that there was a chance he was going to feel a bit crappy. And he asked me, "Would I mind postponing it if he's feeling a bit crappy tonight?" And I was, a bit, and I was, I was kind of like, "That wouldn't actually be too bad if he feels a little bit." Crappy. So I was kind of hoping I was going to get the phone call today to say, "You know what, Jim? If I'm going to take a shot, I'm feeling a bit. Something to me, I'm not feeling good." And I'd have been quite happy not to play. But we said we were going to do it tonight, so we do it. So yeah, you know, I, look. Um, I should have probably stopped about two or three hours ago, um, but um, we said we were going to play. So I, I, I hope, I hope we did okay with the with the donations. Uh, I hope that there's uh, there's a bit of money in the pot there for that group that wanted to go that want to go to the Moscone Cup. Obviously, you know, the idea was that it was going to be in Las Vegas. Now that it's going to be in London, that's a completely different financial investment you're making to 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 go over for it. You know, so I hope that uh, whatever we've managed to raise here uh, tonight has managed to uh, to cover those extra expenses that people are going to have. Because I'd love to see all these guys. I was really looking forward to seeing uh, all those guys, all that group of uh, people um, at Moscone in Vegas, and it would be great to see them in London. So, you know, I'll, my show will be okay in a couple of days. I just hope that we've, we've managed to, 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 to get a bit of money again. I'm sorry. For people who tuned in to see a high-quality match, I apologize. It was always meant as a bit of an exhibition, but you know we both, you know we both struggled. Nate struggled uh, playing, and I struggled with him, uh, physically. But um, I think, uh, you know, I hope it was uh, enjoyable enough. Well, I don't care what you say, Jim, because as someone that does live stream and play pool, this was a high quality match to me because it takes a lot of guts to be able to just play on stream in front of the entire world, much like it would be if you were actually uh, like in a match, uh, match or whatever. In front of, thousands of people or millions of people so for you to be able to struggle with your shoulder the way that you did and still play on i mean hats off to you guys. well yeah like i said it wasn't a, it wasn't a real match you know neither of us i don't think either of us really cared about winning or losing it we just wanted to try and put on a bit of a show and uh 
Yeah, I would have, I would have liked to have a bit more fun with it, but at a certain stage it just became very tiring, and the 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 pain that I had became very tiring, so it was very difficult for me to actually continue to engage in the in the in the chat and stuff like that, and the, the fun that was going on with the, the commentary. Um, but, uh, yeah, it is what it is. Um, thanks to everybody for watching. Uh, thanks for everybody who donated. Good luck to everybody in the raffle. We'll be looking forward to see who, Neil, who, who uh, Nate pulls out of the hat as the winner of the Jacoby Qs. The Jacoby Qs are beautiful Qs. I'm a big admirer of the Jacoby. I've got one. I'm trying it. Hopefully, I like it. I'd love to be a part of the uh, of the Jacoby family. But uh, we'll have to see how that goes. It's probably good. I had to wait two or three days to, to hit a few balls with it because of my shoulder. I'm probably going to have to wait another four or five days to hit another few balls with it now. <laughs> I actually had hope to play one of the sets with it tonight, but it just became too difficult even with my own cue to, to, to make balls, so I didn't bother uh, um, switching over. Um, Nate, thanks a lot, Cat Daddy. You struggled a bit there, Parley. Eh? Yeah, I mean, um, this is actually the... So I, I played the Predator 10x4, um, and that was, you know, that was, um, that was an, an experience, but uh, I broke dry seven out of ten times there. I was, uh, actually, when I played the 10 by four, I actually had COVID uh, and I was on day two of COVID. So I was actually like really beaten up uh, really hard. Um, so that was the only, actually the only virtual event that I've ever actually played in. And it's a different, it's a, it's just different. Um, Cause I mean, I, I can't even describe it. If you've never played a virtual event, I mean, it's like you break the balls and uh, if you break dry or if you dog a ball, I mean, you want nothing more than to just sit there and watch your opponent in front of you. And, you know, even if they sit there and break and run a four on you, I mean, of course, now my uh, headset's going to be dying again. But uh, the idea, the idea is uh, I mean, you're, you're just so in tune to like try to bat a lot of your funks by uh, kind of watching your opponent and just be like, you know, once you get back to the table, I mean, taking advantage of it and you spent your entire career kind of learning how to exist in that pool world. And this is, uh, I, I don't know how to battle out of funks when you're playing in virtual pool. I mean, Jim, you played in hundreds of these things. It seems like at this point, what, uh, what do you do to battle out of that? Um, you have to just remember that, that, you know, you, your opponent is the only advantage your opponent is getting is they get a chance to, break you know you're not missing the nine ball or the eight ball and leaving them just two balls on the table they've still got to run their rack afterwards if you're struggling you know um it's just a tough it's, it's, an, it's another sort of mental battle that you go through um definitely that i especially, mean especially 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 with the break you know especially with the break and if you get down on yourself you, you can very quickly you're, you're out oh, of the match you know and uh you got. You, I don't know. I, I I really don't know. I don't know what the secret is behind Ghost Tool. Really, I think it's more, you know, stay a little bit like the same. Stay in the moment and just, you know, when you're at the table, take your chance. You know, and the break is the break. You know, sometimes you get yeah. a bit of bad luck. Sometimes you get, you know, lucky and your ball, your your, your cue ball's going in, but it gets kicked away. You just yeah. stay. You, you think with as many you've got these. to attack. You've got to attack. You can't be defensive playing Ghost Tool. You know, you can't. Yeah. If you've got a wow. problem on the table, if you've got a problem on the table, it doesn't matter if you. Uh, there's no point in waiting until your last ball to address that on the table. You might as well go with it at it with your first shot, yep. because you've got the ball in hand. You know you can you can open it. Maybe you don't. Maybe you don't get position on your lowest ball, but it's the easiest way to break up. So you've got to play really offensive pool when you're playing ghost pool. Yeah, I don't. Um, yeah, what Kelly Fisher said, isn't it, Nate? She said many times that what. Ghost Paul has taught her is you've got to be much more aggressive, and it, it yeah. actually helped. It's helped her other game. Yeah. You know? well, it's a huge yeah. confidence booster after that because there are lots of shots that you normally wouldn't take in a regular match because you just end up relying yeah. playing safe. And then now, after you've done them so many times, you're more confident in taking them, and then you can be more offensive and and play a defensive shot later. That's at least what it's done for me with all the ghost racks that I've done before. Because now, like, every one of these cut shots that I've seen or uh, the, some of the bank shots that were taken, I was like, these are cut shots also, at least for, in my opinion. Because uh, I'm not afraid to cut a ball just to try to move the cue ball around. It, it, it really does boost your confidence in being able to take some really risky shots. Because you normally don't take them in a regular match. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, and that, and, 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 and once, you take, once you take them on playing Okay, this is, this is all great, but none of this is answering my question. 
Oh, how do you how do you Where's get out? Of, how do you get out of your funk? Being well, I mean, being more being more aggressive is key. I mean, it's a, you know that I knew that going into it. The point is, when you when you're sitting around just staring at a computer screen until it's returning. At the end of the day, I don't really care because I'm not playing another. I don't know if I'll ever play another virtual thing like this again. I. Um, but if we can move on. I, I, I don't care. It doesn't well, really matter. So like, oh, here, come on, here, here, here's, here's my answer to that, though, if, if you find yourself in a funk. Because really, in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't really matter what your opponent is doing at their end of the table, right? Because you're really only playing yourself since it's, since it's just you against the ghost. That's that's my that's my exact point. And right? you, so, you kind of sit around doing nothing and then, well, at the end of the day, I mean, I, I don't, Jim, we can talk about this off air. I'm not, I'm not super worried about it. Let's, I don't think anybody's tuning in to listen to this right now. Okay, that's fair. Yeah. Guys, I've got to shoot anyway. It's pretty late where I am as well. I have things to do. Thank you so much for inviting me. It was a, it was a good laugh. It was, it was a nice little bit of an escape for me as well. So thank you very much for inviting me. Yeah, thanks a lot, Mark. Sorry it took, sorry it took so long. That's <laughs> okay. It was fun. It was good fun. Yeah, Thanks, Lil Chris, Chris, you can give the you can give the plug out if you want. Okay. Get us out of here. So one last time, everybody, I'm putting up on the screen the Jacoby uh, Heritage Three that we are giving away via a raffle. Um, it takes uh, donations to the stream to enter into the raffle. Actually, let me mute Nate for a second. So all the ways to donate to the stream are in the pinned comment on Facebook and the top comment on YouTube. Every five dollar gets you an entry into the raffle. And then for the highest donator, the highest collective donator, they will automatically win the poison break cue that you see on the bottom there. So this uh, raffle will occur sometime during the weekend, and we will be taking donations up until the raffle. So you can still keep on donating probably until, I think Nate said, about uh, Saturday afternoon. So all I can say is thanks, Nate, for allowing me to be behind the scenes here and try to run the stream. I hope I ran it smoothly enough for everybody to be able to enjoy. I know I had that one little hiccup where uh, no one could really hear anything, and I think the YouTube uh, at the beginning of the stream had a bit of an echo issue there, so hopefully all of that uh, at least was enjoyable. I suppose with your one mistake, that, that still trumps my 37, so I, I guess you're okay at this. <laughs> well, it was certainly listen, a lot if of you, if you got. If you, if you kept the score up to date, you already did better than Nate has ever done. <laughs> <laughs> so I'd be happy to do uh, one of these again. Well, no, I'm not letting. Him, I'm not. No, 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 I'm not. I'm not letting him up. It's very easy to keep the score up to date with us. I mean, we only score once every 45 minutes. <laughs> yeah, but but that's what I mean. So it comes as a surprise when it happens. So you've got to keep concentrated, you know. Well, you can save up a lot of you can save up a lot of focus to be able to update once every 45 minutes. But you're, really? just, you're just you're just grumpy because you can't focus when you're playing ghost tool. <laughs> <laughs> but really, and guys, to me, a... this was a lot of fun. Mark, it was a pleasure having you in the box here with me, uh, doing some commentary. Um, like Cheers, I said, mate. Nate, if I if I need if you need me to try to do this again, as long as I've got the time, um, I'd be happy to do it. <laughs> yep. Thanks a lot, Chris. Cheers. Thanks again, Mark. And then, Cheers, uh, guys. Uh, Nate, nice. anything else you wanted to close this out? Sure. 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 Oh, oh no. Oh, my headset just died. I don't get to say anything. I hear, we can uh, hear you. So he is now muted because the music is blasted. So I'm going to go ahead and close this out, everybody, for being here. Y'all have a good